for the thousands in attendance and the millions watching around the world. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's get ready to rumble! This is the cutting edge on our FM day and it's Wednesday. You're listening to an onslaught of Desmond Deck and the Aces. You might wonder why we're playing these Desmond Deck and the Aces. Because we those people play some Desmond Deck and the Aces. Yeah, man. I saw the vibe tell you, start out with some Desmond Deck and the Aces. One of the, the, the forerunners in internationalizing Jamaican music. Desmond Deck. big, big music, them. Well, if people who are listening to them tune, you know, never hear this group yet, or do you ever know the songs them that was there before them band that created an impact on the international stage to make man now can come, come tour. When the man are in England and make tune, tune get big and spread out in a Europe. And now you have festivals in a Europe rep- present and represent like we say especially with those citizenship that was granted by my bridging them and sister most of them are my bridging and sister me know for years I'm glad to say that Wuli them now is officially citizens of Ghana and we hear we hear that Ethiopia is following suit and you know, you just take one domino to fall and then the corresponding dominoes will fall too. And we're glad for that. Because it's something we've fight for over the years. Now, months ago, months ago, I talked about like January, February, March, April, May, June. About May, around so June. The, I was told by a minister, I was told by a minister of government that we will be hearing an apology from the government in August about this Carol Garden thing. Well, months after, we hear a next politician come and Cabo program. And say in a couple of weeks <laughs> that will take place. Then now further down in the year we hear them say it is coming. But here we know. You see all the things set us on now. All the things set us on now. Them go I have to do it. So them could have older and little more, little longer, little more, you know. It is destined to be done. And reparation will be given to those who was fallen. And Rastafari will continue to rise. Rastafari will continue to rise, no matter what they want to say. I do. Because there's so much obstacles that have been placed in front of I and I. And we jump over them, heat ease. Some of us fall by the way. Some of us never realized that there was a light right beside the end of the tunnel there. So I will never switch and turn back and get crazy because when we realize about look over that same thing there all the while and now we see the thing come to fulfillment. Some we start out Ital and now we love Kentucky and Burger King. Yes. And then just when we realize say, we can't lift the Ital, we say men and people who we used to call Babylon start to hold up the Ital liberty and start to see the benefits of certain things that we were saying over the years. We are all leap we left now and gone left it. We gone left it because we feel say there's an easier route to the whole heap of things where the elders them used to go through and even 
Ones like me, so now we go through so much things that sometimes I drive and I sit down and I think on it and tears come on my eye, man. Yeah, man, enough tears too. You know, one nice boy go on, our motor just gets so soft out, so, but we soft out because we remember our memories don't leave like people. Life not dead. Life continue. And when we remember certain things, we shed tears, man. And if we come see the obstacle course, them just a broke down, boof, 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 and we just a jump over them, so and I say, yes, 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 yes. And then we see someone's just a shift. And I go like, say, them just say, the light, they there. The light, they there, man. We see it. That we're not blind. The light is there. And we would have hoped a whole heap of other ones who tried this road of Rastafari I would have seen it too. No make them kick away your foot, you know. No make them put things in front of you where make you start to gaze. Anything where you achieve, you must be achieving it out of your own liberty and creativity and understanding. We're not going to make them turn around and I smoke cigarette and I get mad. Because I want to tell them to tell you, ganja will get you mad. But no, a cigarette, I get them mad. Blind garret, as we call it. So, when we are saying that, a 2017 winner, 2017 winner, you know, and the light, the light are shining, you know. It's just that people sometimes when the light bright so much, some people shut them eye and still at the darkness. But you have to recognize that the light has shine, man, the light has shine bright. So if you can't open your eye and see it, you can close your eye and continue to the darkness. Hope is there for the hopeless. And when we look and see where well, Rastafari got you over the years in a Jamaica. In a Jamaica. We I talk about a man I tell you about say, right now. If, what about the other minority groups? Then look at there's no set of people in a Jamaica will go through the tribulation and the degradation and the abuse and the ridicule where I and I as Rastafari got through. None, no group. So when we hear people are talking about, yeah, but if you give this to this group, you have to give it to that group. So we don't have that. We don't have that. We don't have no other group where get killed for them feet in a Jamaica. And get imprisoned and locked up for where they believe in her. And we get ostracized. And where them children can't go to school. Right across the board. And the lie with them tell Panay and I over the years. And when we look now and we see we are going in the Jamaican society. It's easy to say, but we tell you no. So that you know, go on. We tell you no, you know. Look how long we are telling them so we now have vote. Rasta, Rasta, they that say they now have vote long time. And now we see the majority of Jamaican people now have vote. And the majority of Jamaican people are not Rasta. The majority of Jamaican people not voting because they don't trust the political system. We see a little thing right now in the paper. This weekend, yeah, where them say politicians, police, and conductors are the most. Pe the people, the pe <laughs> it's amazing. The people, them not trust or no. The people, them don't trust or no. And that's just a small age group. And majority of the age, the age group, after that, they carry, most of them don't carry vote. 
we are saying that politician, the poly, top police, as not trustworthy in Jamaica. Politician. And if I were a politician, I'd, 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 I'd go on a retreat. Not just with my party alone, but with all politicians who take up politics as a career. When you should go sit down and blue out and figure out why is it that Jamaican people don't trust politicians? Why is it that people sing so much song against politicians? Why is it that when you talk about politician people it's in this day? Why when politicians depend on the radio people that turn off my radio, I don't want to hear no politician lie. But them not do that. It's something to think about though. If I was a politician, I would have feel away about it. Just like here when I hear say some Rasta man do this, I say that. I take it personal. I go sit on my yard and say, ratted. Politician and a Jamaica. People say politician are liar and thief. You can't imagine that. And you know say all politicians are liar and thief, you know. But the majority of them is. The majority of politicians are liar. Majority. A politician, a liar, them. And them tell the lies so much now that when them put it cross to you, it sounds truthful. Because you can't go around because you don't know the facts. The majority of Jamaican people don't vote for none of the two parties, them. How the hell that is possible? Oh, it's possible that one party win an election with one vote. <laughs> one. One vote. One seat. And them now check it. Them feel good. Ah, this is a one you win a power you now, the Jamaica Labour Party. The majority of people is not, we don't know. Don't live in no bubble and no illusion. The majority of Jamaican people is not with Uno. Uno have to sit down and figure that out. Uno do have the majority of Jamaican people. As a matter of fact, Uno not only do have the majority of Jamaican people, but Uno do have the majority of Jamaican people who can vote. Because the majority of Jamaican people who can vote never vote. So it's a big, big situation that. Because the view of a politician in Jamaica that politicians is liar and politicians are thief. How the hell Jamaican people come up with that thinking about politicians? Politicians is some normal people who come from amongst the people. We're used to in the same community with we and same thing and do this and do that. And the same people, man, are not different people from Mars. Politicians come and them do them job, them go to them school get them a education and them degree and decide to them to serve them country and serve the people and when them serve when them go in a politics the people them turn around and say politician are thief politician a liar how is it that people start to have this perception of politician when me a little pick me hear about politician, me never hear no politician. Nobody talk about politician a, 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 a thief. Me never hear. Me ne, when me a little pick me, when me see people used to walk up and down with broom and a sweep out this and a sweep out that and one party down there so I keep me and a party up there the same road down a red town and all them places I keep keep election. Me never hear nobody. I mean, me, me, really. But we get away to let them lie. No one, most of Jamaican people don't trust politicians. And if you don't trust politicians, it's them you give the job to make your life, to make your life more meaningful and purposely, purposeful. There's such a word. You, you, you want your life to... To mean something, you want to be happy. 
you want to enjoy all the things them that make life nice you want nice clothes and food and you want to send your people to go to school and you want to have food health care and you just want to be happy and the people them find more happiness in sorrow yes Jamaican people find more happiness in sorrow now we hear all two men get shot we say ratted I only two <laughs> uh, it's a uh, traumatized to the highest level but you know Steve B could say the greatest weapon in the hands of the oppressor is the mind of the oppressed and when we have a group of people that see somebody else's reality as theirs and can't figure out that what they are seeing is not their reality but we are actually living out other people's idea of what is real you are the greatest enslaver of yourself greatest enslaver of yourself you are enslaving yourself to the point of no return because you start to accept your slave master's reality how the hell can a slave and a slave master have the same idea of what life is about when the slave master is dependent on you being a slave to enhance his riches riches and enhance his life your reality can't be like him when the slave master go to church on sunday and preach the gospel slaves be obedient to your master yet still him kill you every day if it's not the food is the gun where my make is the pharmaceutical drugs is the ear where I breed and is the thoughts that penetrate your mind that don't allow you to really think beyond can you need some kind of thinking beyond it can be just where me I go get my next food from where you get your next food from some of you don't want to plant nothing uh, your man called it out there and I say him not no land for plant but more thought that we'll go plant food we're not no land for go plant but him not no money for buying no food neither so him get the money for buy the food and him eat every day we're in a serious situation but when we take a stock and we look on the thing most people when you walk on the road say what you think about politician them say politician them a liar and thief if me was a politician and I that sound out there and I know Muta Baruch has sound that the views expressed here does not necessarily represent Muta Baruka or IRFM. But the views expressed here is representative of the majority of Jamaican people you see I walk up and down on the road every day. Them say politician are thief and liar. If me I walk on the road and me, I'm a ball, the politician are thief and liar, me a politician, you know. Me I go and go sit down with my wife and figure it out, you know. 
Me I go home, go sit down with my wife. I say, tell me, wifey, explain this to me. What is it that we are doing in this profession? Why most Jamaican people saw us as thieves and liars? Because I'm not a thief. I go to church every Sunday. I mean, I preach to pray to God every, every day. I look after my family. You know, I tried the best to fix the road. Why is it that they keep saying we are liars and thieves? I went to high school. I got my PhD. Um, I am now CD, OD. But why they keep saying that? I am not a thief and a liar, so why they keep saying that about us? Is that terrible thing? Is that terrible thing? You're an artist, or you're not know, here regular. Dennis Walks, this is the cutting edge. We want to welcome Tracy in the house. Yeah, <laughs> this is the cutting edge. So we don't play Dennis Walks a while ago. I uh, don't leave. Go on and play. No, the drifter with us play a while ago. Go on and play. Ah, don't leave. No, here goes. Outsider as well. When you go to a party, you hear them. Certain party, really. But like normally, a youth wouldn't play them money because them youth are, don't know. They don't know where them know, you know, them where they, you can't wrong them feet because that's how it goes. But then it's what, it's a big artist. Big, big artist. So I want to play a big artist where maybe not, I, I, I don't think I'll trace you know, all them people, you know, them people have gone far past Tracy. Into it. Why when you mention... A Dan in a Jamaica, everybody knows that they don't trust Dan. I mean, really. You know, you everybody come to a consensus and say, you see me, me not trust the Dan, them, you know. But any constituency where you're going at, you hear the, the man them say, the woman them say, me not trust the politician, you know. And your politician or actually go to go shoot nobody. And you know, you know, politician involved. With blowing up no building. But people just not trust politicians. Politicians will have to take a stock. We we'll have to take a stock, man. We we'll have to take a stock. Oh, yeah. We want to play our next artist so we know say who if I want to know. And I think we're going to continue this right through the night playing artists where we think that most of the ones them who are listening we don't know, but made an impact on the music. We're going to play this huge guy now. He named Delano Stewart. Delano Stewart. Outsider. Sir Cox and Dad. Well, you have had us too, but you have Duke Reed, but you have a sister named Sonia Patinja. Sonia Patinja was responsible for produce enough, enough big tune, including the one at all. Big message song them there, big message song. So we are go to our next man where most one we know him but don't know him as a singer. He used to do with a group named Soul Syndicate. Big band that in them days there, and we want to turn to Earl China Smith. Earl China Smith bust Muta Baruch up on the reggae scene, reggae world. I am responsible for boss Muta Baruka. I can't hear them say boss. I can't say it. And I can feel no way for him say it. So I am boss Muta Baruka. I can't say it publicly. This is Earl China. Syndicate. Harvest uptown, but farming downtown. May I tell you? I come like all 
farming uptown nowadays too, you know. <laughs> Nobody is not speared the whip of our political leaders, man. May I tell you? Everybody I feel it. We're gonna stick power rich in a smith a little bit, you know. Yeah, we wanna yell up junior buys. Last week yell up junior buys. This week we yell up junior buys again because we go visit junior buys last week. So we wanna yell up junior buys. No, Junior Buys is the dub club. Sunday, we did up a dub club there. Sunday, Junior Buys. You know, say, one of Junior Buys' biggest songs. Well, he may have no big song. He may have Curly Locks, Babylon, Beat Down Babylon. But this one here especially was written by Earl China Smith. Yes, only well, people don't know it, but we are telling you, no, I heard you know, Smith write that song, Yankee Junior buys it. Listen. Yeah, the man called Junior Biles. Yes, Junior Biles, I hope you are listening. It's <laughs> not easy, you know, we are telling him, it's easy at all, boy, we are telling you. And I know him would have made some bag of money, I know, you know. Yeah, man, the amount of people want him in Europe, there's unbelievable. So, we are telling you about all the people them not like the politician them. There's a consensus out there. I know me not a scientific poll star, but me know. So I saw it go. You ask most people and say not trust politician. So you I say no. You have a set of people who are follow right behind the politician, them, you know, the preacher. The preacher, them are follow behind the politician, click, clock, click, it, clock, clock, clock. And that's not a good sign. That's not a good sign when the preacher, them, cannot be trusted. Because over the years, it's preacher everybody trusts. The Rasta was the opposite of the preacher, when nobody not like Rasta. It's not, they don't trust Rasta, you know, it's that they don't like Rasta. They don't like how we are alive. They don't like how we go on. They don't like how we look. They don't like how we believe in her. But the preacher is the other one. Or the preacher, you like how the preacher look. You like when be You like when go on. You like when believe in her, everything. So the preacher was like the epitome of what you're supposed to be as a Jamaican citizen. Even though you never have no big job and thing, but... You preach the word of God with Trump. Other things. If I have the word of God, you are beyond reproach. You don't get involved with certain things. People look by you different. Unlike the Rasta man. When people see you, them say, nastiness, dirty, madness, ganja smoking. Your head, I mean, your head look dreadful, barefoot, nyam pure, vegetable, like your rabbit. But the preacher is on the other side. The preacher has him family. He goes to church every Sunday and I'm white shirt and him tie. He stand up on the pulpit and him preach the word of God. And everybody love him. It means what the society is supposed to be. Everybody loved the preacher. But guess what? That was then. That was then. No, the people must say the preacher, they're a liar. <laughs> I tell you. The young people, they're a ball out to the preacher, they're a liar now. Young people, we're supposed to know what they're supposed to move up now and step up. To come emulate the preacher. But when you're looking at the realms of preaching now, I like a me, I know. Me stop like preacher from me, I go to a Roman Catholic church. When a Roman Catholic preacher pass and pass, when my name Father box me. And the, the, the thing that hurt me too, you know, is a big fat white boy box me on my face. And him is a father. You call him father, this father, that father, that. I don't know how them get father. And them don't have no woman. How them turn father and them don't have no woman. But you did have 
others who were not fathers, they were reverent. If you know what reverent means, you know that them is reverent, one who is to be held in awe. The reverent is held in awe. And him is what you're supposed to be. Kind, generous, honest, decent, law-abiding. How much of these people we hear police all for involving a sum thing that is unlawful? Me remember a youth kill a person up a stony hill. And when them do them investigation, them find say the youth was retaliating. He was retaliating against the pastor because what the pastor wanted him to do, he wasn't up to that. So in order for not succumb to the pastor's innuendos. Him kill the pastor. Big, big pastor. Well, well respected in the community. Decent. Shoes shine every day. Have on him coat and him suit every day. With him Bible and I'm on. And the youth kill him. The matter of fact, the youth, was set, the youth used to sell outside of the church, church premises. These is pastors who we look upon. No, nothing, nothing, no vile, no, nothing. You, you, you respect the pastor, man. You respect the pastor. Pastors are people in your society who you respect in the community. All the bad man respect the pastor. When the pastor come round, the bad man shake and quiver. Bad man no one say certain things when pastor beside him. When you know say a pastor that you know one cuss bad word, you say pastor shut your shut your ears there. I will if a woman see do that. Let say, Pastor, close your ears there. We can tell this boy I want whatsoever, whatsoever. Pastor was respected. One of the most respected group of people in Jamaica was the pastor. The man who preach at your church every Sunday. You go to him to hear the word of God. Thou shalt not kill. Love God with all your heart and with all your soul. And your mother and your father that your days may be long in the land. Thou shalt not steal. Thou shalt not commit adultery. No fornication. Them words eh, bring, make you, you shake when you hear pastor. I utter them words there. Eh. I utter the Bible. And you know, say, I him have the word. I him have the word. But as we seek to find the truth, we find say, the truth sometimes is not the truth. Sometimes there is no the truth. There sometimes is a truth. Sometimes your way is not the way, but it's another way. Sometimes a man says something, and he must say, this is the definitive way. Not knowing, but you have other ways. So in the search, in the quest for self-identity and self-preservation, we who understand that the world is not centered just around one faith and one understanding of self. But there are 
so many trees and there are so many leaves on that one tree and there are so many rivers but there's only one sea and when you look and see what is taking place now in the earth and you realize eh, the past of them is just another guy around the corner the past is just another guy around the corner where I look food, clothes, shelter. He want to be happy. So I sell you a thing where he never achieved yet and he will never achieve. Which is this argument about go to heaven. And yet still he want all the things that him tell you say you mustn't get here on earth. All the riches where him feels say him deserve. I remember one time a big bishop, when name, uh, so, when name, I was a bishop named Errol Beer, say, in the early, in the 80s, them say, watch your man, if the DJ them can't go, they're going to make money and think, they must be able to make money off of the word of God, too. I mean, I wrong him. I mean, I wrong him. If a guy, if a DJ can't go, they're going to chant pure dance and it's a madness. And I make millions of dollars. Can't afford to buy birth in these bands and, you know, Go in a hotel with gal every night and all them something there. A pastor supposed to can't do that too. Buy Mercedes Benz and go in a hotel with Wooly Pack Gal and them something there. Why not? Him have the word of God. No pastor wants to be dying and can't bury himself again. And no have no money to bury himself. Even though him say I go to heaven. And him don't want to know, say. Some nice little ladies in the audience, in them congregation, that like, do have no man. And even if they have a man, who the hell cares? Ding dong goes the bell. Sometimes the bell doesn't have no tongue in it. But it's still a ring. But are they so there? Are they so there? Pastors, preachers. Politicians, teachers, government people are some serious creatures. The people them have to find them way out of the maze. Marcus Gabby say, if you have no confidence in yourself, if you have no confidence in yourself, because this system uh, make the people them lose confidence, them not sure, the people them insecure, the society make them lose confidence in themselves. And Marcus Gavin said, if you don't have no confidence in yourself, you are twice, not once. You are twice defeated in the race of life. In, in other words, you lose. If you have no confidence in yourself, you lose two times in the race of life. But with confidence, you have won even before you have started. You want a greater mantra than that, man. The words that should have in a King James Bible. If you have no confidence in yourself, you are twice defeated in the race of life. But with confidence, you have won even before you have started. So you now look for the guidance from above. You look for the guidance within. You look for what is in you that is best defining you and your possibilities to be great and to be happy. Confidence in yourself. Define your greatness and what you want to be. And most of us want to be happy. We don't care about 
political ideology or religious practices. We just want to be happy. Simple. And these little frills come with so much baggage that it now allow you to be your true self. Because every time you try to be your true self, something will only so I block it. It's either some guy just come with some religious talk or some guy just come with some political ideas where not carrying you nowhere. And we just want to be happy. Who can fight that? Who out there can say more to have talk foolishness? You know want to be happy? We just want to be happy without the whole heap of frills and chills. But all you can be happy and you don't have no confidence in yourself. Most of them don't have no confidence in themselves. When you make a guy take on a mind, and have it, your mind and do what he wants you to do, the greatest weapon in the hands of the oppressor is the mind of the oppressed without a doubt that thing that you call mind that divert your attention from understanding self because you make a next man control that part of you that mind part where your 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 your, your life force your energy that's supposed to make you be become that divine human being You can't find it because you think as a slave in the mind of the next person's mind. This yeah, this is the cutting edge on RFM. That was a little clip about Columbus. This is Okonoro. This is the cutting edge RFM. That's serious music, man. I want to listen to the lyrics of them junior. We don't just play them junior because we just play them junior, you know. We play them junior because it have a certain message and a certain vibration. We will feel it's necessary and important for the people them here. So we're gonna play it again. Why you love Marvin in a Chilani them a bridging? Yes. We're gonna play it for him too, you know. I hope you might listen to them lyrics, you know. Listen. See a lot of things there in one three minute song or five minutes. In five minutes a man some of our but things. We continue the journey, you know. We continue the journey. A serious thing. The images. The images that we at least them implant in our mind and our psyche has become part of our reality. These images is what is causing a lot of the trauma in the African people's mind and consciousness. Images, very difficult to get them out of your head. No care how conscious you say it is. It's, it's, it's dear, man. It's, it's deep, really deep. Believe you me. And the only way. The only way we can declare ourselves emancipated, we have to emancipate ourselves from that mental slavery. And Marcus Gave again, you know. And Marcus Gave again. Marcus Gave said, emancipate yourself from mental slavery. Because that imagery, are those imagery, that was placed there is one of our main detractors from self-realization. That confidence in self that see Marcus Gave talk about. And him go back and tell you, say, emancipate yourself from mental slavery. 
The mental slavery is a dangerous slavery, you know. That is the slavery where a man behaves like a slave but don't know him is a slave, you know. That is the slavery where no chain no depend on your foot, you know, and you don't see no chain so your feet are so free. You see the chain depend on your brain, but you can't lick it up because it's deep in your brains. It's indelible. And them, 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 them brain, them wash your brain so much that it, 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 it get, it, it cake up. And Marcus Gavit did not see that and understand how mental slavery is a deterrent from African people finding themselves. That confidence in self that make you successful without even starting. <laughs> what a thing, what a thing, what a thing. But it's trying to be a beautiful thing when African people wake up and realize that they have been duped. For years and centuries, they have been duped by politicians and preachers and little boys in the streets with guns. They have been duped. Talking about that heaven we up in the sky that we can't enjoy now, but after we die. After we die, we will inherit happiness. And those of us who don't hold fast to that European mindset will be burnt in fire. The time is 12 o'clock and that year. Brothers and sisters, this is Charlie. Join us with respect for our national anthem. Let us stand and defend this one. Peace and love. Thank you. Eternal Bless our land, who guide us with thy mighty hand. Keep us free from evil powers. Do what our lives, do our lives, to our leaders, great defenders. From above, uh, 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 uh. justice, justice, truth, truth, be us forever. Jamaica, land we love. Jamaica, Jamaica. Same Muta Baroka. Same IRFF. Same. Yes, Light on Bar. Same. And Mr. Rabbit. Same. Same. Stay tuned, RFM. Muta Baroka. Cutting it. Same. I'm Slide Dunbar. Right, my name is Robert Shakespeare. Stay tuned to RFM Muta Baruka. Right now, this is the cutting edge. Same. It's a motor. Muta. <laughs> the man rough, man rough. It's just tough, tough, tough. Cutting head sharp. Sharp, sharp, sharp. Yes. Operator. Send in the call them here. Yeah. Make we hear what the people them are saying out there. Yeah, send in the call them operator. Genetically engineered crops in agriculture, a worldwide experiment on people, animals, and nature. Cultivation of genetically engineered crops like soy, maize, cotton, or canola have far reaching consequences. 90% of genetically engineered crops belong to the corporate agricultural group Monsanto. The rest are owned by Syngenta, DuPont, Bayer, and others. Genetic manipulation of crops can have uncontrollable consequences. The function of genomes is only partially understood, but foreign genes are still introduced into crops. 
These genetically engineered crops are widely cultivated outdoors where they cannot be controlled. Currently, 90% of GE cultivation occurs in the Americas, particularly in the USA, Argentina, Brazil, and Canada. It seems researchers have forgotten that genetically engineered crops once outside can no longer be controlled like they could in the lab. GE crops can self-replicate and pass on their new characteristics to neighboring crops, penetrating the fields of farmers who want to cultivate their crops without genetic engineering. Adverts from the genetic engineering lobby claim genetically engineered crops produce higher yields, but this marketing mantra is a complete hoax. It has been shown that crop yields for GE crops are no higher than normal crops, but farmers must buy more expensive patented genetically engineered seeds each year. This forces them to become dependent on corporate giants. But that's not all. Genetic engineering giants also produce pesticides and herbicides. There are two characteristic traits of genetically engineered crops. They are either resistant to herbicides, in which case the genetic engineering company itself produces the suitable herbicide, or the genetically engineered crop emits an insecticide. Whether or not the crops are resistant to weed killer or give off poisonous gases, not only weeds or pests are eliminated, other beneficial field growth and some living creatures are killed as well. But nature adapts, so pests and weeds develop resistance to pesticides. And that means that increasing amounts of stronger pesticides will be used. Especially grave consequences are observed in this respect in monocultures. For example, in South America, rainforests and other natural landscapes are destroyed every day to make room for genetically engineered monocultures and pasture. At the same time, the soil and groundwater are poisoned. On top of that, the genetic engineering lobby claims genetically engineered crops can help to reduce world hunger. Genetic engineering is not the answer. There is enough food on Earth. The problem is that it's not distributed fairly. But the fact is that most genetically engineered crops find their way into the livestock chain. So they end up as meat or dairy products in supermarkets. Along with all the destructive effects on the environment, one last awkward question remains. How do genetically engineered crops affect humans and animals? The answer is, no one knows. Therefore, it's important for you to carefully consider which products you buy. Get informed and get involved, because our world is not a testing ground. For more information about genetic engineering, go to greenpeace.org slash GMO. Yeah, this is the cutting edge. Yeah. Greetings, Mother Baroka. Blessed man. Yes, man. Blessed love for the new strong year, call 2017. Yes, sir. Um, really appreciate you know, for the commentary you make and then the introduction of this program to sit tonight. Regarding development of Rasta, the liberty of Rasta, where the Rasta Bedi name did stand for from them time there, eh? which wasn't even recognized. Mm. Yeah, I remember one time we have a paper called Daily News. Remember that paper there? Eh? Yeah, well, I mean. Yeah, I seen it one time and then beat up a Rasta Bedi, lick out all them nice, nice teeth, the more time I know. Mm. And I remember trim, trim out the Bedi locks too. <laughs> you understand? And it's where the bread in it stand for. You understand me? Yeah. And nowadays, you now you see things are changing and come on. So, really give thanks to the confidence that, that a light is seen at the end of the tunnel, you know? Yeah, yeah, man. So, no, so no for the bread in must stand firm in the confidence of self. Because, as I said, Marcus Gower philosophy. Yeah. Without confidence in self, twice one is twice defeated in the race of life. But with confidence, we win, we win even win before we start, you know? Yeah, man. So, I might appreciate all that. Well, you know, what I love to say today is still too. Because mm-hmm. uh, me really say that I will check out this thing at one time, but I don't hear you follow up on it. I mean, I, I don't know if you comment on it, but I never hear a thing on it. Mm-hmm. You know, but when Jerry, Jerry, the Jerry. The absence of Jerry, you know? Yeah, no, I'm not up on the air. No, I'm not up on the air. But I say one of the time probably when you're not up on the air, like I'll put on a Thursday or whichever time, you know? Because mm-hmm. I just make him lose the key at the time because... 
he may have a lot of substance on this, you know? No, come again. Where is it? Like, oh, what? Sometimes, you know, they on the program, like, on a Thursday. Me. And, and you have to look at Bridge in the city. Yeah, we no, listen to no, him no, still, no, you know? No, and no. wins them. We love him still, too. Yeah. And we realize, like, so, you know? Yeah. We love it. Jerry do the same thing to entertain and groom people, mentor them, you know? Yeah, 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 yeah. To do things. But yeah, I said, you know, could have put that far we bridge in Jerry, man, you know? We miss him still. And I said, the bridge, you know, a lot of substance still. Yeah, man, I understand. And we know, he may have helped a lot of articulate things in our mind. I you know the politicians, them, liar and thief. Yeah. I want you to play Dennis Brown too, if you can find it. Yeah. Bloody city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell a lot of really like one about them. You know, I should write that too. Yeah. You should write that too, you know. Yeah, man, I should write it. Yeah, man, yeah. great, man. Me, me, I watch a little bit. Stop one of my bridges shop himself, so my little food and them thing there. Mm. I'm a run at, at the tape with Dennis Brown. Mm. With China, when him just a go him locks and. Dean Fraser and all them, man, they went in now, you know? Yeah. It's a long, long time, then it's one of them in a yellow kind of thing, you know, yeah. you know them kind of like a... Well, well, jump, I, must know, I, can, I, can, I can't put what you said to Cabo still, because it's Cabo responsible for that part there, you know? Eh? No, I said, I can't put what you said in terms yeah. of to, to Cabo. Yeah, man. Uh, well, I love to see that, man, yeah, Jim, because me miss, me miss Jerry all the way, I'm smiling big, you know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah you know? I'm smiling. Of course, I very tall. You know, the last time Mr. Jerry said is when I have a thing up at you with there. And me him bring on sister Minnie, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Many one she said it's six still, but Really give thanks to the daughter that still see you open up the way. So bring back, yeah. open up the way, the, the door has no return. Yeah, from them time there, yeah, man. Yeah, man, a great sister in that too, man. So, you know, more respect and love to the item. Give thanks. And all of Jamaica, Africa still. Love. Give thanks. That's the fire. Yes, yes. Uh, I will. Kabu, why you say? Kabu, come back. Come back with me here, say. I'm going to talk to Kabu since you come back, man. Why you love Kabu, you know, who run to England left me, you know. What kind of thing that? Come back and everybody say hi, me come back. And every time I go where she know, every time I come back, she know. Like one way, busy. mind them boss business there, you know, Cabo. Man, you know, work that way there, you know. You're supposed to tell me when you come back. And as I like when me tell you when me, I go and tell you when we come back. So we are working. Yes. Now we have to watch your back all way, you know, day other day. We have to watch your back. Yes, EL. EL. Yes. I look for last year. That's a far right. Why I want to get a link from with you because look for what I go on our country, Mr. Boy, you know the thing. That's a way in our society. Mm. You know? People where we supposed to confide in and put your trust in Adam and let you down. Mm. You know, left to right, the politician, the past, as they ask the you know, the police, you know, really have the confidence in them at all. Mm-hmm. You know, trust them, you know. But we have a society that was shaped by the Europeans, as they asked about the reality with them giving. You know? Mm. And the reality, uh, it's not really a workout for me because... I know who I No, because they are waiting for this Jesus to come back for salvation. And as they always say, the more we call upon Jesus, the more the murder rate go up. Well, if things go up, the more uh, they pray to the wrong God, man, you know, see that? Well, it's all about thing when a man control the perception, mm. you know? Mm. Mm. So we give thanks, I look forward to see them at the, the rebel salute there and think, I don't know what thing. Yeah, yeah, well, you know, so I'm here, I'm here, but it's, you must me, you know, you must me, you know, you you must me, you know. You know, I remember, I remember the drama with you the last time, man, with the, with the, with the seat, man, when I give you the drama and see it with Mr. Green, man. Mr. Green, Mr. Oh! <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you don't know the water. You don't know you're the father. And John, we have to give thanks to the guy because the guy sitting on a part over the last 20 years. Eh? Yeah. You know, it reflects even... We can't remember when we come up with him to come up at the poetry festival the way to keep up at Portland there eh? yeah. a couple years ago. I made a reason. I said, I said, I know what I buy from you. And I said, yeah, man, keep them, man, because one day, you know, I'm going to see the youth, my youth come and run. 
All you know, right. my party, you know, so. Right, beautiful, man, beautiful. Yeah, man, we love the journey, you know. Right. So, yeah, man, so give thanks and just stay strong. Give thanks, Bridget. Yeah, yeah, man, Rasta. All right, yes. Yes, no care what you do, you must be moved over a river salute. Must. <laughs> if you did it, you must be. <laughs> ah, it's a... Did you know that scientists all over the globe are creating extremely bizarre human-animal chimeras? Over the past decade, there have been some absolutely stunning advances in the field of genetic modification. Today, it is literally possible for college students to create new life forms in their basements. Unfortunately, laws have not kept pace with these advancements, and in many countries there are very few limits on what scientists are allowed to do. Extremely creepy human-animal hybrids are now being created in laboratories all over the planet. And this is just the stuff that is publicly admitted. Can you imagine what kind of sick and twisted experiments are taking place in the dark corners of secret labs that nobody knows about? And what happens if these creatures get out into the wild and starting mating? At that point, it would be nearly impossible to put the genie back into the bottle. Scientists seem very eager to test the limits of what is possible, but what they are unleashing may have consequences that none of us ever dreamed possible. Did you... Say. Yeah, people, you know, we can create new life farm in laboratories. You know, them class to new life farms, you know. That is what you call hybrid life farms. Hybrid life farms, I tell you. Animal hybrid means uh, it's a kind of animal. Wow. So now, look at where I see some animal on the road, I wonder uh, where them animal they come from. New life farms. Scary, man. Very scary. I could go up and one more of them clip here again. Them shot, but them talawa. Before the 3rd century, the church in Rome was one of many churches that were scattered all over the Roman Empire. The reason the church in Rome later became the head of all the churches of the world and dominated the Middle Ages was because it joined hands with Emperor Constantine. As a result of Constantine's pro-Christian policies, many people who believed pagan gods converted to Christianity. This consolidated Constantine's political position. And there was no need for the church in Rome to refuse to convert because it was a good opportunity to secure its religious position.
after the church in Rome accepted pagan idolatry and doctrines. It was quickly secularized. During the Middle Ages, it was even hard to tell the difference between the church and the secular world. The Catholic Pope enthroned kings and kings protected the Catholic Church. Opposing the Catholic Church itself was rebelling against one's own country. The Pope wielded an absolute power. We can see just how powerful he was through one incident, the humiliation at Canossa. That happened during the time of Pope Gregory VII. Pope Gregory VII claimed that the Pope could not be judged by anyone on earth and he could dethrone emperors and kings and excommunicated Henry IV, the emperor of the Holy Roman Empire, in the course of the investiture controversy. As Henry IV was faced with the crisis of being dethroned, he went to the Pope who was in Canossa. Barefoot, he knelt for three days in the snow outside the castle of the Pope and begged for his forgiveness. This is what is called the humiliation at Canossa incident. The Pope had so much authority that there was no one who was able to hold back the church from abusing its power anywhere in Europe. Not only that, the popes committed numerous crimes such as murder, blasphemy, simony, and adultery to hold on to their seat of power. tell you we still play the red side but can you imagine them them dynasty was so corrupt that even the normal man on the road look like saint even the normal man on the road look like saint when it come on to the atrocities of the popes of Rome. Man, may I tell you, man. And this is what Christianity is based upon, of is founded on. This is what Christianity is founded on. I dare anyone to tell me different. Christianity was not founded on love and kindness and generosity and compassion. It was founded on death and destruction superstition and greed that is what is the foundation of christianity people want to tell you about it was founded on the teachings of christ not no go so the teachings where they matter about it come after not before not before is after what it was founded on was murder, death, and destruction for anyone who don't believe in it. So, if it is founded on that, if I am right and it was founded on that, why you feel say it going to change through time? Time not change, nothing. Things evolve. It can evolve either for the worse or for the better. And when we look at the history, the history of Rome, as it relates to the, the authority that it bound these people who call themselves Christian under, why we think they're going to be different now? Yes. Yes, Mr. Blessed man. Yes. 
I'm more than just asking me to understand how me I listen to your years you now and it's like you blame Jesus Christ for all these things. It's not yeah, Jesus Christ. Yeah, you, you, you blame Jesus Christ or nothing? Yeah, we have a Christian because you make it sound like say, a a Christianity create man's stand up. And a Christianity create man's stand up and make them a kill off people by earth. Me, me and a Christianity do that. Hold on, hold on. You ever hear me blame Jesus Christ? Yeah, with a yeah. Then when we blame Jesus Christ for you say Christianity, no, we have no, the people no, no, in a confusion about Jesus but, Christ a Christian. Jesus Christ a Christian. Oh, me ask if Jesus Christ is a Christian. But no more. Then I give him Christian Christ. Then I no, understand you. No, no, Christian is the people them who follow Christ. Right. Then that don't mean that Jesus Christ is a Christian. Oh, he's a Muslim. I have said Jesus Christ is not a Christian. Christian okay. is the people them who follow Jesus Christ. So he no want nobody to follow him then. He, he, no, he never no. come as a man. So you have said he no, wasn't a man like Martin Luther King no, and like Marcus no, Diaby. No, I have said it, you mm. never hear. You never hear. You say. But what you were talking about Jesus Christ, what you tell me say me say about Jesus Christ. You never yeah, the Pope about and the man we had enough food to pass the Pope and Jesus and Christ. I honor Jesus Christ, make him a beat. I him have the power to beat. A man on rule earth. You know, Jesus Christ now on rule earth. A man on rule earth. May I ask man. you a question? May I ask you a question? Mm. Where you hear me say about Jesus? I blame Christianity. Yeah, then, all right, then, so, yeah. All right. yeah, okay. Me blaming Christianity don't mean say me I blame Jesus Christ, you know. Okay, Neil, all right. I could be wrong, I could be wrong, all right. I don't stick up in now because Christianity is a belief in a, a man named Jesus Christ. Right. So I blame the people, them, who call themselves Christian and the philosophy mm. we're buying Christianity. Mm. The fa- the, the, what, what I just said a while ago, that Christianity... It's founded on what we call these people, these Romans, these yes. Catholics, who designed this. But one of them was the first Christian. Who was the first Christian? The first Christian was a white man. No. Was Rome? Who was the first Christian? I don't may I ask the, you. the first Christian was Jews. The first Christian was Jews. Where the people of Jesus were in right. so them culture, King David, them people eh, was the first Christian, not King David himself. Yeah, no, but that, that, that the culture of eh, Israel, Jerusalem, yeah, and never Jews. and never Rome was Christian. Then come after. Where they, which part in a Jewish tra- tradition you So when so we're on you now. So yo, no, it's, it's a book, you know, Rasta. It's a book, you know, it's a book, it's a book. And you are you are in that book, you are reading many books. But uh, you you are reading a book at the start of your show, you read a book. Teach you say, teach the children and they will what you say? Teach them greatly or something. You have to rather than rather than sitting there, you say, I want man I say that. Yeah. I want people, I want white man I thought that the yeah. talk. Yeah. And you not feel no way about him. That the boy they are talking that talk. you not feel no way about him. So what him and the white man. Yeah, so so we are So me you never you never hear me quote white people on a program ahead. You never hear me quote black people on a program ahead. Yeah, we quote many people, black and white. Yeah, so that means, well, that means I'm open enough to find truth in anything where a man say, whether I'm black or I'm white. All right, good, all right. So I okay. to you now, who in the Jewish, who in Jews was Christians? Which well, which you not Christian? believe in the book. No, 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 tell me not believe in the book real. No, so tell me about that. No, book. wait, no, tell me what me not believe in. Tell me where mm. the book say. Because I'm reading it just like When that. Jesus Christ was born, for, uh, yeah. he was born in a one, one culture named Israel. And one man named um, Herod was the king. Yeah, so and and our one next man named Caesar was yeah. the ruler also. Yeah, so who was Christian in at that time? When, when Jesus was born, it, yeah. well, nobody... Christian is after him come start preach for him thing. Okay, so who was mm. Christian? Who was Christian when he might preach him thing? Then, 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 then according to what is written on the book, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, and, and the man, the John the Baptist. Which part in a Matthew mention Christians? The word, well, uh, yo, the word Christian come way after people start, like people call you after. That, mean, that means that nobody never named Christian then. 
People start calling Christian later on years no, after. No, no, you say Christian. All right, you know what I mean? Them people who did a push Jesus talk, yeah. them are put what he must have said. And nobody will call them Christian them time. They're not going to call them Christian. They don't want to do it. But I can't just tell you a while ago, I said, I'm foolish. I just tell you. I just tell you, tell the people they never named Christian. I had to say, what I tell you. I just tell you, tell the people they never named Christian. I had to say, what I say. I just tell you, tell the Christian to you know, the, 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 to them which are Antioch, one place yeah, named Antioch. Which part Antioch? Don't hear them turn the whole part. But near the near part, near the near part when Jesus was alive and the yeah. near part, yeah. them never named Christian. Yet. I'll get around down, down the line, them get to name Christian. But I just, me just I tell you a while ago, I have but against but, me. But then the first Christian, the, but, but what I'm saying is when the name Christian starts in Antioch, mm. and never the, the, the Pope, was the first Christian, and then we want to take it. You hear me say the Pope was the first Christian? When you hear me say the Pope was the first Christian? No, well, I'm going to say, I am him the, I'm, I'm him the true example of Christ. I'm going to get to right. Wait, no. When me tell you, say the Pope was the first Christian? You are talking about the, Yo, you are saying the Christian. Yeah, yo, all I will know the enough things about about European, you know, all that we know about Europe and how them, and what them I do know with man and I don't see them when I don't see them when I do yeah, everything. But ask you, when Not me tell change. you say the Pope was the first Christian, when me tell you that? No, you yeah, are say the Christianity, don't but you are always say about Christianity. Yeah, but it's always yeah, a problem and blah, blah, no, come on, no, you know. No, no, you have to get the thing right, you know, because you don't, you can't come by the radar and say things when me never say. I expect all right, to agree now, a long time left, you know, and, 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 and you always have a problem with, yeah. with, with, with certain problem. things, I mean, yeah. I said, but that's not fear. Yeah, but you and what me have a problem with? What me have a problem with? What have a problem with is pie in the sky, and which we can understand that. Yes. And and now we understand that, and, you know, pie in the sky, make me clear. And yeah, why, I don't know how you do it too, and yeah. Why is, and why is my and, problem with? And we believe in a, in a black liberation for all African people. Black equality, black power. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah, but what me have a problem? Tell me what else me have a problem with. Well, and, you know, and, and uh, and, uh, you know, like and, the book and, 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 you see, like you say, like you say, um, self-confidence is great, which is true. And you say, that should be in the Bible. But it is in the Bible, because the Bible says, so, uh, as a man thinks, so is he. But it's not, it's not the same thing as saying if you have no I just feel as a man thinks so is he. So if you think great, when you're great, you think you're idiot, you're idiot. And the same difference is a confidence in yourself. Yeah, you're right. Marcus God is a confidence in yourself. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that. Me never say nothing wrong with it. I'll quote it all the while. No, but you say it you said that should be in the Bible too, I'm not sure it's a believe that or not. It's not the Bible too. But right. both in a one different uh different words, different vibe like him I say. As a man thinks, so is he. So just like how you was, you're that great artist, and we all know that, and then you create your, your, yourself, your greatness as an artist, like how Bob Marley did it for himself, and we all admire that. As a man thinks, so is he. May I listen to your version? Because I'm yeah, so, 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 um, no, a long time I listen to you. May I listen to you from... The first times, I mean, I said, show me I mean, I like when you just, you know, you really like the part where you, you make it look like there's no legitimacy. <laughs> because you, you respect Slash Yai and him no, did, there's him there's did no respect legitimacy. certain things. There's no legitimacy in what? In our Christianity. See, especially for black people liberated from white domination and white oppression. Be fireborn that. Fireborn white oppression. Okay. Yeah. Me love, me love Celestia. Mm. He, he never did bow to that concept of the image, those images. In deal with him, in, in deal, he tell the white man, say, yo, we are, we are the business with America, and we are the business with Russia. I saw him tell the white man. And the white man was like, him shocked him and what to do. And I'm going to deal with them right and in build up Ethiopia to be a mighty military power. See that see I did that. Yeah, they never bow to no false concept. What? I mean, I mean, well, I'm going to ask you a question. Mm. What 
mighty military power still has to say I build. Um, we, 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 we don't know, but, but we have the book. No, we no over which country? Ethiopia had a mighty military, my youth. No, over what country? If you say mighty military, I mean, you put it with that. Himself, no, he never tried to dominate nobody. No, I never talk about domination. I say, you say, him build up a mighty military power. Yes, Ethiopia had a good army, yes. No, wait there. You say... You know what I know that? Wait, no. You say, I listen to build up a mighty... In Ethiopia, yes, sir. Wait, no, man. Okay, okay, okay. You say, I listen to build up a mighty military power. Yes. I am asking you a question. What is the mighty military power was over? Over the Ethiopian country, sir. You have a mighty military power over your own country. What not now? When you must be an answer. You have a mighty military power over your own country. God, God. The man have defense. Good defense. You have to understand me. Against your own country? Not against his own country. But for the, for the defense of his country. What do you mean? Let me understand you, I think. He had um, an air force. He had a navy. When the British, when the British brought him into Ethiopia, they wanted to remain there and turn him into a idiot. And because of his dignity, his dignity and his integrity, him get them out of Ethiopia and him get weapons from all over, get weapons from America, get weapons from everybody, and became strong and independent. It's in the book, the art of Arab that you have highly slashed and all them books there. And in the speeches of Paris, like it's all there. Each of them was strong and powerful and had a good money system. Everything was great. But then, then eventually get rid of them. But because them, 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 um, invade the youth, them mine and destroy everything. Until life ain't wicked and the people are starving and blah blah, the whole story. Same thing the, the man do with the man stand up seed. It, it, the, the world about the same thing. And that Jesus Christ has been him after that, my youth. You hear me? You got, uh, Jesus Christ has watched you them. You gone back to the same thing again. You gone back to the same thing again. Yeah, yeah. You gone back to the same thing. You hear me still on the radio and I blame Jesus Christ, brethren? Like I said, I could be wrong there. All right. You never blame Jesus Christ. All right. Come say the same thing. Say me I blame Jesus Christ. You hear me I blame Jesus Christ? Well, uh, I'm not going to say that again. No, but you, 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 you go around and I come back around to the same foolishness because you're going to come yeah, but, out of the radio. But what I'm saying is, you're going to come out of the radio and you're going to sit down with your brethren. 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 I know it once he also, he must also say to them, Jesus Christ was a man of color. And tell them that, you know, the white man tell the white boy them that. Say Jesus Christ was a man of color. Stop saying he was white and stop, you know? And them and make it look away. And then people are take it up. And then the youth them and say, what? How can I deal with that? Which we can understand what the youth them and say. But then I mean, you know, I know, I then bring my, is them whitewash everything. I then do it. Watch out, watch out. If you're, mm. if you're deaf on the radio, I talk them with you, you see? Yeah. When me always, I say. And then mm. everyone come to me and say, me I blame Jesus Christ. Yeah. It not going to make no sense to me, you know, because you see where you are say, or where me I say mm. to, and where mm. you are saying no, me say, me never say that. Me never yeah. blame Jesus Christ for nothing. You never come hear me come and read that I will say, Jesus Christ, this and Jesus Christ, that yet. Yes. About it's people who claim Jesus Christ. Yes. And then me talk about the second, me talk about the past, not past now a while ago. That's when me talk about the politician a while ago. The second, me talk about the Pope and the Pope of Rome. Them. You, you, you may never mention nothing about Jesus Christ more than say them man that say them a vicar of Christ. They represent Jesus for earth. And look what them are doing. You never hear me say nothing against Jesus Christ yet. Mm, okay, sir. And if, if somebody can remember me saying something against Jesus Christ, put it on the radio and make, make, make me remember what I said about Jesus Christ, against Jesus Christ. 
Every time you hear me talk, me talk about people who claim Jesus Christ, who represent Jesus Christ, who claim say they might this and they might that, and I not yeah. let them can't deal with them. See, sir. Don't come on the radio and come talk about me. Every day you hear me, I blame Jesus Christ for this and blame Jesus. Me never yet blame Jesus Christ. All right, sir. All right, sir. So we're we gone now. I'll take some advertisement. All right. Let's say. Are you? Yeah, this is the Culture Net, John RFM. You know, it's a weird thing that somebody can come because me I talk about things where people who believe in a Jesus Christ do. In the name of Jesus. And me condemn the action them, where them are do, where them say. And a man say, me I blame Jesus Christ for the man them action. Me not blame Jesus Christ for the man them action. Me I blame the man them because them believe in a something where don't make no sense to the concept and idea of all life is. And when me talk about God, me talk about God as a concept. So the concept that is projected out there by man is when me attack. Me attack that concept, that concept that man say God said this and God do that. And he say, but oh God, I go do that. And then him go do that. Oh, me forgot to realize that. Me can't go sit through that. If God said this, that's why let him go do that. That's all. I mean, a man, a man, just like when he bridge and I say, and him feel some animal say something different. When I say nothing different, you know, it's just that him not like here when me claim, say, these people who are called themselves Christian is the most divisive and corrupt set of people upon earth. Then true me say that no me I say so me I blame Jesus me not blame Jesus a man Jesus not in a my thinking Jesus not in a my thinking at all me read about that and me realize that I me understand that 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 not in a my thinking a man me I blame for develop them concept and ideas that will have no significance to the fullness and the happiness of human beings because it has been tried for thousands of years and all it created more destruction and war and rumors of war and make nation rise against nation and all these things. If it's not helping you for thousands of years, why are you holding on upon it? I ain't afraid to let it go. Well, if people are afraid to let it go because I feel same I sin. And him I go in our bind now. Say then if that if not, if that is not the thing, then what is? A human being create the devastation where men are by holy but philosophy and thinking and perception. And this one thing, this one name will dominate the Western world. That name become a problem. In a this part of the world, because man develop attitudes because of that name and behavior because of that name. That man even tell you say is that name going to save humanity? That's how far I'm going. Because tell you say the name I'm going to save humanity. Thousands of years gone now. And them create more things on top of more things, more life on top of more life. Rome. Rome. Not Babylon. Rome is the instigator and the perpetuator of all of the things them where you see are going around us so now where we can now declare is evil. We have said that non apologetically. That Rome. And when I say it, I have no religious perspective neither. Rome is the inventor and the creator of all the things them round we know. Because it's not to develop our true potential of divine human beings. 
Because we are divine. In our humanity, in our humanity, we are divine. But given we are a final self, in the time of a final self, in our spirit of a final self, very difficult to find that divinity in the humanity that we search for. Because Rome, not Babylon, create images, names, ideas, thinking to block we from that divinity. We are blocked from the divinity because of a system, a system that was created in Europe that dominate the Western world that we come now, taken from our land and brought here not by free will but by force. And force to accept this philosophy that is now binding us more and more and more, whether politically or religiously, economically or socially. It bind we and I grind it to pieces. And the more we grind to pieces, the more we are ball out feet save way. The more suffering is the more we ball out. Jesus Christ help we. The more we are suffer is the more we ball out for the help. These men of Rome create that that bind the whole western world and parts of the eastern world to bind them bind me that is very difficult for come out tight a man who come pick sense out of nonsense sense out of nonsense and then tell we say we attack against jesus christ I not attack against Jesus Christ. I attack about men. I attack against men who come up with a concept of Jesus Christ and expect the whole world to accept it or else they are doomed that people will tell you that. Say, if you don't accept Jesus Christ as your personal savior, you are doomed to hellfire. That is where I fight against. That is what I have a fight against. This idea that was placed in front of us as a people, as African people, will tell we say, if we not accept that, there's no redemption song that will be sung. Don't tell I about I have fight, I have, I attack against Jesus Christ. I talk about men who come with that concept and expect I know to accept that concept. I don't know what is it that is in that concept that I as an African who is searching for liberation and freedom should hold on pan. Not that old ragged cross, that suffering emblem of suffering shame that was placed there by Rome. Because that's how the Romans kill criminals. They put them on crosses. And in that place, they call Jerusalem in Golgotha. The rock of the skulls. Inside of skulls where they put criminals. And now we say, black people, African people wearing these little crosses around them neck. The emblem of suffering and shame. Who decide that you must wear that? I know Babylon, I Rome. I may mean, talk about spiritually and physical Rome. Rome have done more cruelty and wickedness against the people of the western world here than Babylon itself as a place and as an empire. It is the kingdom of Rome 
that has now governed us for centuries and then make sure by manipulating a philosophy manipulating a philosophy that was there thousands of years thousands of years before them give you anything named Jesus that philosophy was there and then bring it and manipulate it and put it in our psyche that if we go beyond that you, you say ease up or where you deal with or you cannot go fight against that you know see that is the thing where you're supposed to work with but we know better now. Them now go fool we again and now go trick we again, you know. And more and more ones are rise up against it. More and more ones are rise up against it. And I realize eh, it now nah, enslave me no longer. We're gonna free yourself. Yeah. Yeah, blessings. Yeah, blessed. I bless. Yeah, I call from out of the coal box, eh, you know. We should have the coal box. I love coal box the vote, you know, you know. <laughs> no, yeah, man. Yeah, why you said coal like coal? Yeah, man, it's real coal, man, you know. Mm-hmm. How much degrees it got, yeah. you know? How much degrees today? But, you know, it, it did then I fought it earlier. But, you know, I night, now it dropped in I 20. So it don't got no minus yet? No, no, you know, not reach a minus. <laughs> you are going to some place where minus. No, man, me, me not got them place there, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so yeah, what I so, The sign's still there, and you know, the Capricorn sign, so I have a happy belated birthday to you and okay. I, you know? All right. Oh, yeah, you're born in the Capricorn sign, too. Yeah, the 8th of January. Okay, all right. Give thanks, Bridget. Yeah, man, blessings. A long time, me, I listen still, you know, first time caller. Mm. But let me see program six and a half year. But, um. The way you say six and a half year, where did they? Then I marry Maka, you know. And you can't get felicity that I marry Maka? No, because I don't have the live um, oh. IRFM channel. So oh. what do you mean I go to the YouTube thing and this you find it? You find, pop it, up. You find yeah. the, the program them. Yeah, so you're too married. You're too, you're too married at the Maka, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're too married yeah, at the Maka. <laughs> who are you? Who are you? Who are you? The Maka married. Yeah, but, yeah, but I listen a long time still. And start catch up back on the program, go back to some years and yeah, thing, you know, and I go good, and man. listen. That is good, that is good. Yeah, man, enough of proof, man, to have to show it to you, young youth like me, you know. And speaking of Mary Maka, you know, that is where black people find themselves, you know. Them feel joyous in the Maka. Them feel happy in the Maka. The Maka juke them, you know, them feel like, yeah, juke me more, juke me more. It not, it not, <laughs> It's not merry as a man. You know? No, no, I use it as a metaphor, you know, it's a metaphor. No, me and, no, me no, me understand, me understand, but me as enough people are kill themselves to come as on. Mm. But I, you know, pretty, if everybody could uh, come and see it and then they must mm. say no one for me, you know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yeah man, but but they must realize it still, you know. Look more yeah, than go there and they must realize it, they must go. I tell you, yeah, man. my word. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. All right, now I have 27, you know, and I want to push back home, you know? Yeah, but where I stop you? <laughs> well, me just get a lick with you, you know, so I have to just okay. watch him grow and, yeah, and yeah, set yeah. the him still, right, you know? Right. And teach him right, you know? All right, so I give thanks. Don't make the maca yeah, joke like what joke you do. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm not growing in that way, you know? <laughs> Yeah, it's difficult, it difficult to grow a youth huh? in America and make him get touched, though, you know, I tell you, you know. Yeah, man, it's very hard, it's very yeah, hard, very, you know. Very, very hard, man. That the society mm-hmm. today is very influential, man, because look how far Jamaica there and it influences Jamaica, the whole of Jamaica. Cool, no, man. Mm. <laughs> yeah, but as me, I say still, because I, I attract the righteous, you know, and I eat, eat healthy and things, but. Long time, you know, eat meat and things still, but we did not eat it as soon as we come down to a year ago, but me drop it, you know, and I just mm-hmm. cheat, eat and, you know? Yeah, yeah, But yeah. enough time people would answer me and say, you would, why, why you not eat meat? And I say, oh, mm-hmm. man, we <laughs> can't indulge in them things no more. I grew up and mm-hmm. find out, say, no good for you, you know? They must say, then how you live? Uh, like you have to eat uh, meat, uh, you uh, live. I don't ever believe <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, man. And I watch one of your things with you, BSU, I say, book, 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 and 
Yeah. I did buy a book to fight, but we don't really go through it yet, because it which just come about two days. Which one of the book? The um, Survival in the 21st Century. Oh, big book that, big book that, man. Big book that. Oh, yeah, man. So, I'm going to go through it one of them there yeah. and see what you have to offer to there. You know? But them still have the book there on the market? Yeah, man. You can get it off of Amazon, man. What? No, no, five book them and me say and you basically talk about anything. They me, me, me look them up on Amazon. You know, you know so all the people ask me about that book. They tell them, so, boy, I don't even know which part to get one, you know. So you said, them go for Amazon, yeah, them can't get it. Survival in the 21st yeah. century, yes. Yeah, man, if them go for Amazon, them can't yeah. find it. Them, 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 and them they have the new updated one, too, you know. Yeah, you know them book that when we go a bush and I may mean, try to find certain, certain things, I'm going to read them book there. And then years yeah, after yeah. we have this program, I interview the brethren who write the book. I think the book of my mind, in the 70s. Yeah, yeah, but we interview the brother there when them, in the 90s, you know. When him come and join okay. him, we have him on the program. But from in the 70s, I read a book there. When I read a book there, I just almost just left school and I said, Rasta and say, I want to do certain things. And I go hear about all sprouts and... Sprout seed and all them something there without you have to plant it at the ground. You know, them book there are some serious book man. Yeah man, for real. And and yeah. look at the topic where they are talk and they just know about the Jesus thing and them thing there. Yeah. It's like what the man for you with about Philly. Mm. But to me, man, me not believe in them book God and them thing, you know, so me I leave that tell them so. When we drive off and we are about to hit the highway then say something. But through any time me I talk, me about to say, man, they must say, no, no, don't say that. Because I know when, when God has put his hand on you, nothing happened to me. So, <laughs> so <laughs> if them God so good, why am I going put his hand on me? Mm, yeah, superstition. You know? Superstition, man. But I make a, for them world, make a word of it for them world, I'm yeah, like, they last to society, you know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, man. And the next thing to before, before me cut, um, Last week, I listened to the program that was a stepping razor, and me hear you tell a man, say, you don't like to hear a tune name, um, first nine years. You hear a tune it? Name, first, oh, that's a uh, Sparta. Yeah. Sparta, me that talk about, say, me that love him make a tune name, because every time them, cut, them want him as a person of interest. Yeah. He make a tune, man. One day for your cash flow, cash flow do it. He make a tune name, person of interest? Yeah, man. Well, he must not make that before, but he just bring it up because he never mention it. No, man. Uh, you don't know how them youth are nowadays, go, man. I think he make it after and hear you say it, man. Say, <laughs> no, I don't think so, man. That quick, man. That quick. But uh, last week, Thursday, we attacked people about it, you know. Yeah, we know. And it come out um about two days after. You know, take none for them youth to no, write no, 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 nowadays, no. man. Yeah, I true that still. I true that. But no, but it's it, it interesting that... A three time now, him is a person of interest to, for police, you know. Yeah, I think any time you see a mob here, man, then, as he said, then he has become yeah. being style. So you when know? me say, why well, you should have make a two name person of interest? And yeah, when you say you're two day after? <laughs> yeah, man, you're two day after, who man. Who and he, he, he well put together, to be honest, it well put together. Who you here played? Who you here played? Um, you know what I'm saying? A YouTube, me go up and I hear it. That means they did it before me say it, man. <laughs> well, <laughs> maybe, but it, 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 when, when me look on it, 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 uh, it posts, I think, last week was, I think. A Thursday, me say it. Thursday, me say it. Yeah, Thursday. It Thursday posts, was the. Uh, it posts Saturday. Six, no? Yeah, I think me see it Saturday, the 7th. The yeah, and, and it said, it said, it just upload. So, me not, me not sure, to be yeah, honest. Yeah, 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 yeah. I must ask them, man, uh, tomorrow morning. Both it. Yeah, yeah. But him, uh, uh, if you know, if you know, mind man, you can't give it a listening ear. It well put together, you know. Yeah, well, the tune. You remember me play a tune when we done interview him. There, it is a well put together name Redemption song. Yeah, yeah, well yeah. Well put yeah. together song. Well put together, mm. song, you know. And watch out, you see them you know, because you with them you know. You see them you know, it's not that them don't know what we do, you know. It's just that because the system and the society set up a certain way. Them fees say that they're going to carry them through, so they just do it. But them know what to do, you know. They yeah, know exactly yeah. what to do, man. They know what to do. It's just you have to bring it out of them, make them know, say, yeah, you know, that way they, it can just last a little time, but after a while you have to come round back to the reality of the thing, you know, them way they. 
Yeah, and the tune we brought up Jay do name Blood Money. Yeah. I don't know if there was a problem if they did take it off of YouTube, but I've been searching for the tune for the longest while. Let me not play it every, every week, I play it, man. Yeah, but me I say on YouTube itself, when you type in Protege Blood yeah. Money, I say all of Protege are the tune that come up except yeah, the one yeah, they yeah, want you yeah. to me go on. Where you go on? I find it. Where you go? I go up on a youth page, a youth, a youth, YouTube page and I find it. But when you type in Protege uh, uh, itself, blood money, well, it's yeah, not pop up. I uh, don't know why. Yeah, I'm searching about them, Judy. <laughs> yeah, I have to listen, listen and go on up with me, you know, because I listen to a lot of chronic Protege and mm-hmm. Kibaka Pyramid and the young young generation are asking them. Mm-hmm. While the Macan also joke, the Macan also joke so much when you listen to them, eh? <laughs> no, man, no, man. I will I keep positive, you know? Yeah, all right, Bridget. Give mm-hmm. thanks, yeah? Yeah, man, blessings. Yes. Ah, uh, it's uh, the mark up the terrible, you know, Rasta. Yeah, man. You remember when Lula with it around go England, man? Feeling say the place was like the streets was paved with gold. No, everybody in a, hey, me not woke up, no English. Jamaican youth when I want to come home, you know, even if you never born yet, you know. With all the crime we are going on at Jamaica, you know. Most of the youth them when me hear born in England from Jamaican parents and they want to come to Jamaica. I don't know if I meet up on the wrong youth them, but that's all my experience. Just listening to them. Them say, boy, them come to Jamaica already, but it's a place where them think that they could have lived. Can you imagine that? It's like the tourist thing. Look how the crime are reached down here and tourists are getting more, more tourists are coming to Jamaica. It's ironies in ironies, man. Ironies in ironies. Look how much crime and violence in Jamaica. And tourism is on the increase. Maybe I'm one of the only sector where really, you truly are saying, you see a direct increase, a, a increase in revenues, serious revenues. Why may I tell you? Wonders never cease. Wonders... Never see. So, so make, a, make a safe of call this. Yeah, EL. EL. EL? Yo. All right. I'm going to dry it down, you know, so I'll we'll get a chance to answer. Okay. <laughs> uh, nobody never did it. I know what somebody did it now, though. Hey, EL. Blessed Muta. First I time see. caller. Ah, uh, well, Pierre, first time caller for about three, from his... Three weeks now, be your first time caller. <laughs> mm. But anyway, thanks for the positive messaging still, you know? Mm. But regarding your previous caller, I touch upon the Christianity topic still mm. differently. You have... No, you know, say I listen to your radio, though. Oh, uh, well, the radio really low, but can't really yeah, hear the me, radio. Yeah, but me, I hear the radio. Uh, turn that down. Yeah, still yeah, yeah. But anyway, you, you have some some um positive points where you are touched upon. But? But the brother still am right if you go back to the collapse when Hannibal did lose the war, the Roman war, mm. that gave the Romans them the entry into Africa, right? But even going back previous to your talk points in regards to Paul, Paul was the one who changed Emmanuel's name to Jesus. No, man, Paul, even if you go back... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, man. Paul not changed nobody's name to Jesus. Yeah, man. man. Paul, the one who get knocked off of the house, man. Paul is the one. What language Jesus is? What language? Yeah. Well, some people would say Aramaic. No, no, but no. Me, we're no, no, myself we're would we're say. We're the one on the You saw me ask you a question. What language is Jesus? from? What language the word Jesus come from? That's a Greek language. 
Jesus is a Greek language that Jesus, linked to wait there, wait there. Alexander the Greek yeah. and Constantine. Yeah, but Jesus is not a Greek word. Exactly. No, I said but, Je wait, no, Jesus is not a Greek word. Jesus is, is a, a title. His uh, rightful no, name yeah, is no. Emmanuel. No, listen to that me. That is Bridget, why Bridget, 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 said, I am he from Ori. Brethren, brethren. We don't want to go after another tangent, you know. Let me ask you one question. What language the word Jesus come from? You just said come from the language of Greek. It is a Greek language. But I tell you, said not from Greek language. What, 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 what language um Jesus from? Jesus is a Latin word adapted by English. The English them take a Latin word. The 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 the. the, the Greek word where you are talking about it, Jesus. Jesus is cho, Greek. Cho, cho, cho. Jesus is Greek. Jesus is Latin. The English yes. them take it because most of English word them come from Latin, Greek, Nama, yes. and whatsoever. So there's the, the, that is what we are talking about. The word Jesus don't come from no Gees. It not come from no Aramaic. It's a Latin word. But for cut the cheese, we're not, right? We're not, Paul never take the word. Did not Paul give the word, the word, the word. Yeah, man. Jesus. Yeah, man. If you do your research, but Paul, Paul comes a... with the Bible much, man. No, brethren, we just come to agreement. Say Jesus is a Latin Greek, a Latin English word. And you gone back and say Paul give the word. Here Jesus. was the, the man where we are talking about as the Son of God. His rightful name is Emmanuel, not Jesus. Is, that is why Selassie yeah, 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 well, is named after him. But I don't agree with you. Why? Because the man where you hear them at the Bible, not the Bible, them called Jesus, his name was Yahshua. No, sir. Yahshua is the Yeshua is a... Is a, a Jewish a word, which General. is from the Khazars, the Eastern Europeans, them that converted and take the Israelites, them the word um, pretty much, um, how you would call it, um, the, 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 them birthright. So, right, so let me ask you a question. In the Ethiopia, yeah. Who them, the man who them said lived 2,000 years ago, who them, what is the name them use? His rightful name is Emmanuel. No, no. What is the name that them use in Ethiopia? Me not know right, me, me tell what, you what them use. name me tell you them the use in Ethiopia, but, me, but, me, but me you have to understand name them, that me. Ethiopia pretty much joined with the Europeans when it became the Solomonic dynasty. Yeah, but that's what I'm not telling you. Them, them use the Greek word, Jesus Christus. But Ethiopia yeah. dynasty go back beyond the Solomonic dynasty. Yeah, but I tell you the word where them use to represent where you are called Emmanuel, Jesus, is Jesus Christus. His rightful name the is Greek. Emmanuel. All right, so where it tell you that in rightful it, name is name Emmanuel. Which part, which would name Selassie I name Emmanuel? Selassie first name, now Emmanuel. Call out the word of Selassie I name. Selassie. No, not say Selassie again. Call out the whole I'm named. The whole I'm named them. Call out the whole I'm named them. Makia. Quote him name right, right. now. What? So Emmanuel is the first name, second name, third name, or last name. Which one? Emmanuel is what of Selassie I name. What, what part of Selassie? It is in his name. What Emmanuel part of name? Is in his name. Which part I'm name Emmanuel is? Where? Where in the name? That, that, well, you can do that research. No, 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 no. But you did the research. You did the research. You did the research. So you tell and, me. And you, that is why Silas is... When them ask him, is a, is a, is a, is a... Him said that, no, man. Listen to me, I said, no, man. And I, the reason why I want to cut you short, I don't no. want you to talk until you, you, you do no. your proper research, no. man. No, no, don't tell me what I'm going to do proper research. I'll tell you what I'm saying. In asking about the Solomonic dynasty, Eilis Lassie says that his dynasty is 3,000 years even to the emperor Ori. He never said him. He never mentioned nothing about him saying dynasty extend unto Ori. 
That is what I'm saying. It go beyond. If you no. use the name Ori, it go beyond the Salabinic dynasty. Then well, let me just say, we, you know, let me say, him say, him dynasty go beyond Salamanic dynasty. Exactly. The, the Ori, so, him never say him. Him never say him. Him never say him. Him say him dynasty. The dynasty. No, he dynasty. Said, I am he from Ori. No, he never said nothing like that. I'm Meaning, he, he is Emmanuel in the flesh. No, so where Iman, which part I'm name is Emmanuel? Which part I'm That's That is for you to research. No, no, you right? tell me that. You but tell me that. To I'm touch upon another no. point no, in, no, in, wait, in wait, regards wait, wait, to Paul. Out. No, we right? can't come off of the point. Even going out. back further, when you touch upon, which is right, in regards to your argument on Paul, it is right. I'm going to lock you off. I'm going to lock you off. Why? Because you jump off of one thing until you know, don't clarify the first thing. <laughs> Me ask you a question which part of Isla Silas' name of Emmanuel in it? When hey, I Buta, you go up on live wire, no, which no, is a Rastafari webpage. I don't believe a Rastafari webpage. Me ask and you. That will, no, don't tell me will no, verify Rastafari. the quote in regards to what Isla yeah, Silas said. Ori, no. said that I am he from Ori. But we don't talk about Ori. Don't live wire. No, we don't talk about Ori, you know. Me All ask right. you a question. What part of Isla Silas' name carry the name Emmanuel? It, it, it is in his name, Muta. Which part of the name? Muta. Me it know him as the far right. Wait there. Me know him as the far right. Me know him as Wait, no, hold on, the hold on, the hold on. Motor. Me know him as Tafari Makonen, and me know him as Ailis Lassie. True, true, true. As Ailis Lassie. So true. which part of them name they know? Which it part the name his, Emmanuel is called in his, that? It is in his name title. The name Emmanuel Wh- is you? in his name title, Muta. Which name title? King of Kings, conquering line of Judah, elect of God. Which part of that have Emmanuel in it? The, the name Emmanuel yes. is in... He well, you keep, I but Regin, you para- keep repeat the same thing. You say which part of the name them of Emmanuel in it? Which All part? right. Me, I say what me, I say. Yeah. You have doubt. Me so have no we doubt. have a belief that, that and you can check into no, that. No, me not have a check. Not, part. Me, watch out. Me not go around right? and check foolishness in a Regin. No, man. Me not have foolishness, Booter. Because, listen to you. Listen to you. And you have conscious messages. What is it? When when them crown I, when Isaac was 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 um christened baptized, what was him name when them baptized him? Christian him. Hello. You 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 said that before, Mo. No, me ask you when them christened Isaac. You, you said was, it, which is right. What, no, don't tell you me. Said it before. What me say? What me did say? You don't remember where you said No, no, that. that's why I asked you. What did it say? Me know what you said because me hear what then you tell said. Tell me what me said. Right. Tell, tell me what me said that was right. Tell me what me said that was right. It's full um, um, name title. No, we're not talking about no name title. No, me say what was his name when he was christened at birth? What was his name? You said it, Muta. What did I say? Muta, with, with the phone live thing right now, I'm, I'm, I'm a little off, but oh, I am right. agreeing with you in regards to yeah. what your reference is named to be. Emmanuel, it is correct. I listen to you have no Emmanuel and I know I'm named them. All right. And you are putting them because you want to elevate no, man. To talk Emmanuel is one of what the Emmanuel I is? Title. What Emmanuel mean? What Emmanuel? Because he is Emmanuel in the flesh. What Emmanuel mean? What Emmanuel mean? Okay. What Emmanuel mean? Tell me what Emmanuel mean now. Where the okay for? Tell me what Emmanuel mean. You know what Emmanuel mean, Muta? Yeah, yeah. Well, Let's school say. me. You are the teacher, you know. But you not tell me you, so you, don't know. Well, you never say you, you don't know. You me well, what you, Emmanuel means. No, I ask you what Emmanuel means. It's either you know or you don't know. If you don't know, I don't know. Tell, m- m- all right. tell Emmanuel, me. Emmanuel, according to the Bible, it means God is with us. Okay. That is what Emmanuel says. God yeah. is with us. There yeah. is no word named Emmanuel 
in a Haile Selassie name them. None. It is one of the title name that he when took. I'll, I'm telling you, Muta. Him take it. But listen, we'll never reach the weapon that. Take it. Him take it. No, we are coming to everything with Haile Selassie take me. Wait, 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 which Emmanuel is within I just have to take that name there. I just have to take that name there. I'm telling you, I just have to take that name there. I don't understand what you're saying. I'm telling you, Muta. Emmanuel is within that title of name. Which title? Yes. Me know the title of I just have to take that name Because he is. I'm telling you, he is. He is. A Rasta illusion. He has some Rasta illusion, brother. Go on to the next subject. You know, Rasta All right. Lujan. Rasta have some money by Lujan. When you touched upon in regards to Paul in your in your previous yeah. um, topics, yeah, then, yeah, as yeah. far as tampering with the Bible, Paul, it is true. Paul tampering with Bible. But the, 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 the thing is that the, the Paul. name Paul needs some more research in regards to the name Simus Magus mm. and the whole Roman Empire mm. that more or less sum up your argument in regards to Rome uh, yes. and the Bible itself. Yes. I, I, the, 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 the name Simus Magus, not Paul, but Simus Magus. Right, who was Simus Magus? Or even Magos? deeper than Paul. All right, explain to me, the Simus Magus. Explain to me. Simus Magus mm. is who them try to perceive in regards to being Peter. As Peter was one of the disciples from Emmanuel. So, oh, Paul who coming at us in our Christianity belief so now, oh, reference as Jesus. So, oh, Paul coming at that. Because. You said Simon Magus and Paul have a relationship. What was the relationship between Simon Magus and because Paul? Because it is showing you that it started with Simon Magus and not Paul. So, it started Peter and not Paul. It started with Simon Magus. Who was Simon Magus? Simon Magus is who they try to perceive in being Simon as one of the disciples of Emmanuel. Simon Peter. That went, yeah, that went to Rome. But oh. Simon, in regards to the disciple of Emmanuel, never went to Rome. The Simon Magus is who built the Roman doctrine that we is accepting now in regards to the Bible, it started with Simon Magus. But you know, but what oh, Paul are coming now because Paul first... Paul Israel. is a later date. So Paul, okay. you have okay. Paul, mm -hmm. you have um, um, the, the, the brother before Alexander the Greek, which is Constantine. Oh, yeah. Alexander the Greek and Constantine are two different men. Exactly. So oh, it started with out. Simon Magus, Paul, right, Constantine, yeah. and Alexander the Greek. But Alexander was before Simon. What was before them man there? <laughs> Listen again, Muta. It, we, just remember, may I tell you, Simon Magus. Yeah, me hear where I talk about Simon Magus. But you start to All right, Simon Magus. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Them try to make yeah, it me hear the part seem say, say like Peter. it is Simon the Peter, Peter from the, the disciple Simon. of Emmanuel. Yeah, what you are saying is a Roman named Simon Magus. Yes, yes. exactly. Simon yes. Magus is a Roman. Yes. And Peter was who? And Paul was who? Paul was who? Pa Paul was a Roman too. That's who tampered with the Bible to Muta. Paul was a Roman. Not a Roman citizen. He was a Roman. Well, yeah. Well... Whether I want to come from the Turkish um, part or whatever. Istanbul. I mean, yeah, yeah Turkey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. True, true, true. But, but even when you look upon all of them people, them motor, yeah. them is known as Khazars. Yeah. Khazars. Yes, yes. And they were the ones when the Romans defeat them. Yeah. Them, them originally went to Uganda, right? For kind of cut out a part of Africa for themselves. And then when the British got involved, 
you have the, 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 the PECOS agreement in regards to how Israel is where it is today. Mm. But them is not original Israelites as we... Um, no, we don't establish that already, Bridget. That, we, we exactly, that Buta. Just that we kind of really feel like you, you, you read some things... And then you confuse up other things. And then no, man. Other things it's no confusion. If you start man. with confusion, Simon Magus, no, I mean it laid the whole man. foundation even before I mean I Alex, um, Simon, Constantine, which you touch upon and I agree with. Yeah. It, 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 yeah, it well, laid the foundation before Constantine, yeah. a brother named Simon Magus. I don't say nothing about Simon Magus. I don't say to you. Exactly. You never yeah. mentioned Simon Marcus before, Muta. No, me never mentioned Simon Marcus. No, Marcus. no. You see, when me no mention. But the brother is more deadly than Pete, um, than Paul. No, but you are now. More than likely, are you are telling me about Simon Marcus now? No, man, Muta. Yeah, 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 I tell you, for you, for yeah, do your search. proper. Yeah, let me not um, tell you. Yeah, but, but, yeah, but from the yeah, Simon Marcus part. Yeah, but me not afraid. But wait, no, me not afraid to tell you. Say me, I got research Simon Marcus, you know. But yes. you must tell me which part of Ireland's last name is Emmanuel. All right. No tell me about you go on a rasta. Next time, no, nobody tell me about you go on a rasta website. No, because only if I lose and I'm no, on a rasta. Live wire. Um, them bona fide. fight. Them bona fide fight because them, 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 them post some, some very interesting um information. When I when was crowned, when I pick up on. When I was last, was crowned emperor of Ethiopia. Two, two motor. You know, say them call out the whole I'm name and them title them. Yes, motor. You hear them mention the thing about the man the title them. Motor, why would they mention an, a name yes. that reflects a man that came back to us in the living flesh? Come back, what do you mean come back to us? Where him come back from? Where him come back from? Emmanuel. No, where I listen to God. Where I listen to come back from. The Son of God in the living in, flesh. In come back from the Son of God? Yes, man. Yes, yes Moses. Wait, 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 wait. That is why wait, the wait, name Emmanuel wait, 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 is no, a wait, very wait, interesting wait, name. Stick up in. Stick up in. I listen to come back from the Son of God. Well, me might not be phrasing it properly in saying him come back yeah, from but the no son of God. Up, but understand. the name Emmanuel. Yeah. You, so you, you don't believe the Prince Emmanuel where in Abul Bay was Emmanuel? No, man, Muta. Why not? Why not? Why not? No, Muta. Why not? No, 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 we are talking about the same Selassie no, from Ethiopia. No, I don't Ethiopia. understand you, Bridget. I don't understand you. But you don't even say Selassie I come back from the Son of God. No, people don't understand that me, no, no stupid. Wait, that not sound stupid to you? Eh? When you just say a while ago, I let Selassie come back from the Son of God. That not sound stupid to you? I let Selassie come back from the Son of the God. Flesh yeah, come, it's it's, Emmanuel. Yeah, him come back from the Son of God. in the Western world today... Mm. Is calling Jesus. We who His right not call his name is Emmanuel. No, but me not call him Jesus. No, me not expect you for calling Jesus. And me not call him Emmanuel. Me not expect no black man for call Emmanuel Jesus. But me not call him Emmanuel neither. Black man for call Emmanuel Jesus. But me not call him Emmanuel neither. Me not call him Emmanuel neither. And you just say it's stupid to say Prince Emmanuel out of bull beer. So, I, 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 who I, I, we are called Jesus? Yeah. We who? You ever came across information that his rightful name is really Emmanuel and not Jesus? Jesus' rightful name is Jesus. No, Emmanuel. Jesus' rightful, rightful name. name. Is Jesus. Yeah, Emmanuel. Was changed right. for Jesus. So who we are called today as Jesus? Brethren, the thing you see them thing I know. That's why the thing gets so confusing, you know. <laughs> yeah, the thing confusing till. It's, not, it's not really confusing, no, Muta. You know, you That's know, why you know, enough people not understand You're not confusing. You're not confusing. I'm telling you, we're not confusing. It's when you take a seed, like yes. a pumpkin seed, yes. and you take cabbage seed, and you put it <laughs> in the ground, and cover it with dirt, and you see it start to grow, 
Yeah. And when you look on it, you see it grow, and every day you go there, you go water it. That yeah. no confusing. Yes. That no confusing. No, that it's not confusing. Yeah, and you see when you're done. Because that's, 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 that's that works. And you, you see it, you see where you see it, and you go so boom, and it come to, to, to maturity, and you take a, a, a knife and cut the start them, and you cut that's it. That's not confusing. A word. But you see all the way you said you know, a pure confusion and more. No man, I'm not confused and I just something new. Oh, that I go help the earth. Oh, that I go help the earth. What oh, you mean? Oh, that yeah. I go help the earth, Muta? You, you know, see how black people confused. Yeah, but and, I say, and, man, and and the man, just them I embrace. Christianity is really us. What the brother was saying it in words, your previous the man conversation the words, the in regards to it man, came yeah. from us until the collapse. Of Hannibal. So I'm from with us, man. Right? Oh, when was Hannibal? When was Hannibal? I fully see attack. Hannibal is, is involved in the Punic War, man. Yeah, 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 yeah imagine. Yeah, 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 mix up the time. You don't know who um, Hannibal is? Oh, you mean you don't know who Hannibal is? Mr. Yeah, mix All right. Up Hannibal, so when him, lo- him lost the third yeah, mix Punic up Alexander, War, yeah, mix up Alexander, that gave the Romans entry into Africa. Yeah, mix up Hannibal, Alexander. No, man, I just had touch pal. Yeah, pal. Yeah, mix couple up different thing. topics for you. Emmanuel, yeah, but the when you, you don't talk worry. to me, I yeah, know you have to check into some of them. I mean, nah, check into the only one. Oh, why are you checking to Simon Magos? Yeah, that's the only one I would have checked. Because it's a deadly youth. That is the only one I would have checked. That is a deadly brother right there, sir. Yeah, Emmanuel is a deadly one, too. But Muta, if you do your confusion. research and you go to the, um, the, the Egyptian thing, Antiquities there. Museum, There's nothing you will that see a, a picture Emmanuel. of Emmanuel, a which picture? is Jesus, where we are called Jesus a today. Picture? A picture? Yeah, man, a black Ch- man. Ch- Jesus is a black man. Jesus Emmanuel is a black man. Then they have a picture of yeah, him yeah, in yeah. the Egyptian Antiquities Jesus Museum in Egypt. But you just don't have to say Jesus is a white man. I know you have to say Jesus is a black man. No, because when the Romans them start tampering with you the history. You just have to say Jesus is a white man. So, oh, no, you can't go say Jesus is a black man. Oh, we are called Jesus. I can't shoot that. We're gone. 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 Yeah, man. You have to get enough time now. You have to get enough time. Me, no, we yeah. not get enough time. Right, well, me we have a get enough time. Me, because yeah. we know you have to check in to... All right, sir. Yes, when, sir. When All right. Yes, sir. Yes. This is what I have to be confronted with. Believe you me. Okay. All right. <laughs> Why well, the time I take love come. All right. We can continue. You know, say I want to continue this. As somebody has a part of one. Yell. Yell. All right, the apparatus that was on the phone long out there. <laughs> All right, EL. Yes, sir. Yes, yes. Yeah, it's my phone turn up, man. Oh, man. I can't. We're breaking from New York. We're breaking from New York. We're breaking from New York. No, no, no. We should be in there. No, man, you're breaking from California. California, sorry. California, California. Sorry, what are you doing, man? Yeah, God bless you. Yeah, I'm glad to see you. You, you, you make it to our next year, man. Yeah, good thanks, huh? Mm. Wait, oh man, I hope I get enough time like this other guy who just you just no, come on. No, 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 and you are not the host um, of the program. You are not the host of the program and I'm get by your nerves. Exactly. You can't do some of these bad for me and get. <laughs> exactly. I heard you back and forth. But anyway, so I found the Zodiac in the Bible. All that stuff that the Bible tells you not to look at the Zodiac. I, I went ahead because, I'm, again, I'm working on my book here. So um, I, try, I'm, I think I'm going to release it this year, but... um. I'm going to go ahead and make sure everybody um, who is in my group um, read over it first to make sure that we get the proper information out to you guys. So anyway, this is from my, from my book here, The Zodiac. All right, so we know we got Aries, Taurus, um, Gemini, Cancer, Leo, Vir- Virgo, uh, uh, Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Aquarius, and Pisces. So here's what the scriptures I found, all right? All right, so this is... Um, here is the Ram, Genesis chapter 22, verse 13. 
first the cow, Exodus chapter 22, verse 3, 4, 5, and 8. Gemini, the twins. This is Genesis chapter 25, verse 24. And it says here, um, now this kind of threw me up for a little bit, but I went ahead and do some research on Gemini. It says, in the Bible says, when E, when, when her days to be delivered um, were full, behold, there were twins in her womb. Um, verse 25, and the first came out red all over like a hairy garment, and they called his name Esau. Um, so now I went ahead and take a look at Gemini. The colors of Gemini is lucky agate, A-G-A-T-E, and unlucky red. So this is all about astrology here. Let me continue. The crab, cancer, the crab. Um, Ezekiel 24, 12, and 16. It's so like you could have your food for fitness shoes, man. Hold on, I think. It's all like you could have your food for Yeah, hear me? Yeah, hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What did you say a while ago? You say you have cut off something? Oh, you see, you never hear what I say. I agree, and you agree, and you never hear what I say. I say. It sounds like you cut off your foot to fit the shoes. Okay, what does that mean? That's like some more like uh, it much more yeah. than me. You know what it means? It means, say, uh, no. What you give the meaning that you're giving to something, the something, is what you are trying to conjure up to make it agree with the something that you're giving it the meaning mm-hmm. to. So you, you, you have something right over here, sir, and you have something over here, sir. So you try to give meaning to the something over here, so By using this over here, so we really don't have no connection with it. But because you want it to fit into what the reasoning, you use it for, 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 for fit into the, 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 the reasoning, the, the, the Zodiac versus Genesis. And all okay. Things, you know. Well, okay, I, I understand what you're trying to say, um, but this is exactly, you know that the Bible is all about astrology, right? It's nothing about, none of those characters exist. All that foolishness that a man was talking about earlier, about Jesus and all that, Jesus Christ and whatever. We know that Jesus Christ doesn't exist. We know that this is all astrology. The Priscatalia, yeah. the holy signs. Yeah. This is what this is yeah. all is about. One, that is one interpretation. That is one <clears throat> interpretation of the thing. But, okay. But, but, okay. but, but you know, that is didn't Jesus know. Christ feed... Um, people or thousands of people with um two fishes it doesn't um the pisces um, um zodiac sign is not two fishes and then jesus christ also says um in luke chapter 22 verse 10 and 11 he says um is as he replied um as you enter the city a man carrying a jar of water will meet you follow him to the house don't we know that the zodiac have houses mm. that he enters this is the um this is um Aquarius, the world here. Boy, you just I said Jesus Christ never exists. But no, what I'm saying to you, I, I agree, Jesus Christ does we we know in reality Jesus Christ does not exist. But okay. in the Bible, right. Jesus Christ made the statement about Luke chapter twenty two, verse ten and eleven about Christ, the water bearer. But if Jesus Christ right? never and, exists, him can't make no statement. If Jesus okay. Christ never exists, him can't make no statement. I agree with you. Then it's Jesus Christ, Christ, um, Jesus okay, Christ okay, okay. Here's what happened. You are right. Jesus, Jesus Christ never exists, so he cannot make a statement. Yeah. According to the Bible, yeah. the character, yeah. Jesus, in the Bible, made the statement. Yeah. Now, in reality, um, in reality, the guys who wrote this Bible, um, yeah. the Flavians, the Greek dynasty, played these roles in there. If it, you want me to be that technical. No, I have to be technical because it's sometimes you're not technical, it's not straight. But I, no, you say, um, I said to you, if, I, if you want me to be that technical and yeah, be man, very frank, you're right. Why be that Indeed, technical? You're right. Be precise. Why be precise, yes. Yes, exactly. Jesus Christ does not exist at all. None of the characters in the Bible exist at all. But um, uh, um, Peter is actually Jupiter. Jupiter. All right, so they're taking names from around the world and from astrology yeah. and they're making up this story and I can't believe black people are arguing over this dumb garbage. They, they imprison us psychologically, 
spiritually, emotionally, and physically, yeah. and financially too, by the way. So we should be arguing over this. We need to get this thing straight and get our people back on track and get our minds together so we, so we can move forward. We are too divided on this stupid Bible. And by the way, there's a lot of Bibles. Because trust me, I have several of them. Yeah, me have a last Anyways, in the philosophy and opinions of Marcus Gav. You know the Bible, eh? I know Marcus Gav. I have not read his book as yet, but I'm supposed to. But I do have his book, though. No, you know, I, I have the book. I want you to read it. The philosophy and opinions. It was put together I by a woman. You. It's a woman put together that book, me and Amy Jakes Gavi. The philosophy and opinions of Marcus Gavi. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you should read it. And I will actually no it's here in my, um, my no, electronic library. I promise it's you. Another book. I promise you that when you read it, you will have no confusion about what Marcus Gavi has said. I, 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 I picture his stuff now, you know. And I, I, and I promise I you, and I, take it from me, I know Muta Baruka said this. I know, say, we're in there, is where I'm really mm -hmm. say. I know, say, I'm did say, where I'm really say, in there. Yeah. Write that down, put it on tape, say, Muta Baruka say, that where he is, Gavi, say, Marcus Gavi, say, in that book there, me know, say, it's true. I'm did say it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's not no ears of business now we are dealing with now. We are saying, yeah. him did really say it from him writings, from him speeches and all these things. So maybe you should have taken up that book and read it. Because you wouldn't have to interpret it. It's on my list. I would definitely jump no, on that this year. Because I'm, I'm, I'm actually writing, I'm writing a book right now. So I'm yeah, doing a lot of research. I'm definitely sure that I'm going to hear what his opinions are. You're going to regurgitate all the things that we had talked about a while ago. But, but, oh, dear, can you tell me I talked about Marcus Giave. I talked about read where him say, where him wife put it in a book form that we can read it and do have no confusion. I guarantee mm -hmm. you that when, when you read that book, you have no misinterpretation. You have no, you don't need no clarification. And no man can come tell you, say, this is where him did mean when him said that, and where him not mean when him said that. Because him not talk in an abstract. And parables. Mm -hmm. Him talk straight. Yes. Yeah, so it, it, it's that nice. If you read it before, you call me back to. But anyway, let me drop this side, drop, drop this side before we get out of here. Um, so my, in my observation, because I, I, um, I'm working on this um, project called, it's really my book, it's called the Laws, Laws of Opposites, and I've mentioned this several times. So I want people to really realize how God created this universe. God created, God created the opposite of everything. Okay, so we have positive and negative. We have up and down. We got lies and truth. Sunny days and rainy days, mountains and valleys, desert and swamp land, north pole, south pole, east, east and west, dry and wet, sowing and reaping, life and death. So I even understand how some people are scared of life, uh, of death. They are dying anyway. Um, you got Jesus and Satan, which is actually a horse and Seth from ancient Egypt. Um, you got creatures of the world and creatures on the land. You got creatures of the day and creatures of the night. You got um, creatures with wings that fly and creatures Wings that don't fly. Humans with arch feet and humans with flat feet. Black and white, uh, dark brown and tan. Uh, so I don't even understand. Uh, people say they are Indian, Puerto Rican, and Mexican yeah, because what's the, what's the, what's the purpose? Just that's 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 the way I say. What's the purpose God, of saying all these things? Huh? What is it? You have to come to the purpose now. What's the purpose of saying all the black and white, yellow and red, red not coast, east coast, uh, west? The law of opposites. Yeah. The what? law of opposites. That's what I'm trying to clarify. To let you know how the universe is created. So what is the opposite the, of brown uh, people? What is the opposite of brown people? You got dark people. And you got white people. You, no, you know, no, no, we have no, black no, people. No, what is the opposite Wait, um, of brown what? people? What is the opposite of brown people? You just mentioned brown people a while ago. You have brown people. Yeah. You have black people. So what is the opposite have, of brown people? You got black people? and white. Um, opposite from um, you got brown, no. right? What is the opposite um, of brown? You got dark brown and white brown. What is the opposite of brown people? As far as I observe, Muta, you got light brown and dark brown. So the opposite of brown people is dark brown people? I am assuming, because that is what happened. As but, far as but, I see but, in creation, yeah. let's, let's look at this. God created a black horse, a brown horse, and a white horse, right? Yeah. Black cat, brown cat, white cat, right? Yes. Yeah. 
So what's the opposite you of see, a white see. cat? What's the opposite of a white cat? <laughs> no, black cat, Muta. Muta. A opposite of a white Muta. cat is a black cat. Muta, what I'm trying to tell you no, is so this. What is the opposite of a brown cat? That's what we need to be paying attention to. Look at how God created things. That's what I went ahead and paid attention to. God created yeah, three, three colors. Opposite. Black, Muta. white, and brown. How many three colors you see? Is that all? I mean, you might have like some um, reddish brown. You want to go to Morocco, Rasta? Morocco? Yeah, you want to go to Morocco, man. Go see blue people. Are you serious? Them black till them blue brethren. <laughs> you don't understand black people. Muta. You don't call me Muta. Okay, yeah. okay they're black till they're blue. But you know that we got black. We're looking at I mean, I, I we're know, looking at this. I know picture Please. me and tell you about you know. I know Please. picture me and tell you about you know. You think I picture black and brown, black, brown and white. So what and is the opposite creation in the animals? What is the opposite? Of, what is the opposite of black people? What is the opposite of black people? I heard the last one question before. We we wasting time on that. No, no, we no, we don't have to drop. What is the opposite of black people? White people, Muta. What is the opposite of brown people? I'm sorry, you tell her on that one. You tell me, say God make three people, black, white, and brown. And the opposite the three of black colors people. that I have known in nature yeah, in yeah, all yeah, animals black, is those colors. Black, white, and, and brown. And now you tell me that there's black, blue, but people, but again, that's and not black. And you said the three colors is black, white, and brown. So, that's what I'm so, saying. So, so, yeah, yeah, love yeah. nature now, balance now. You tell me, say the opposite of black people is white people. Uh -huh. So what is the opposite of brown people, the other color where you mentioned? <sighs> You got dark, you got dark, black, dark brown and white brown. But you never tell me that. You got to turn, right? You never tell me that. Waste time on this, bro. Waste time on this. Got a lot more stuff to drop before. Yeah, but I only want to drop too much in there. Yeah, but you drop too much things. Man, you have to lift up some things, bro. You have to take up some things and start drop them. Uh, we got straight hair and curly hair, right? We got one to um, one to go. We got black people. Black people here grow grow to the sun. We got all other people, as far as I notice, um, with straight hair who grow their hair fall to the side. Their hair grow up and fall to the side. Black people, we're the only one on the planet who here is grow to grow to the sun, right? And as far as I know, with the rest of our um, rest of our is the music say that time they hear the antenna. So that's something that we black people need to pay attention to. Um. Virgin, you know, say, uh, wait, no, no, you know why me stop, stop you so because when you talk some things, me can't take what you say and just make it pass. So. Okay, go me ahead, can't take what you say because the time so gone, you know, and me can't but I get another conversation with you about ear, you know, and if it goes to the sun and this and that. And, uh, you know, that, you know, when black people here grow up, we, we notice that. Everybody knows that. Our black people here grow up. White people here fall to the side. Um, Indians. Some, bla some black people here don't fall. Right. Black people here don't fall to the side. Which, I mean, at least they pray the damn thing, but if they let it go naturally, it grows up. May I ask if black people here don't grow up and fall to the side? Um, um, the only ones who are with dark skin that is fall to the side, the, the ones who call themselves Indians. No, I'm not talking about African, like Rasta. But you can't hear what I say, no, you talk too loud, Bridget. That is, you, that is Rasta man plucking them here and make it over. I'll uh, uh, so twist me here and make it over. So, so if you just leave them here alone, it will so, stay so, going up to the sun. So may I ask you a question? My locks now will flat up. Oh, it not stand up in the sky. Mota, did you, did you manipulate your hair? By doing what? By doing what? Me ni manipulate my hair? Oh, what you talking about? If you leave your hair alone in its natural state, did not put any rasta in your hair, didn't twist it, it will stay up, you will go naturally up. My hair is as puffy as hell, I mean, I mean, and my hair is like straight up going up. I mean, you fall you, down to my back, yeah, on my shoulders. You, uh, you still going higher and higher. Let me tell you about something about black people here and rasta here. <laughs> You saw you're just a lot. Well, I say you got people. Yeah, now, nah, listen to me now. Go to ahead. Me. You see when a man start to lock, mm -hmm. he grow, him ear grows straight up. But you see when he get mature enough, it falls to the side. Him not have to twist it. Him not have to twist it. Yeah, I know. But say, you see something when me up on my head, 
when me did yoga come up, as I'm stop coming here, it grows straight up. You see, after I get matured, it drop to the side. I mean, never put nothing on me, I mean, never groom it. I saw ears stay. Ear grow to the side. It's just that. You mean your hair, your hair fall to the side like white people hear them? Every, hear people. Everybody ear, after it start to grow and get a certain maturity, it falls to the side. Well, um, okay. Well, if you say that, I guess I probably have to go back to the drawing board then and we can do that. What do you mean because as far as I feel out of here, uh, it's not going out there. My ear... My ear when me did younger coming a rasta, it bumped me, it did a grow up. But you see when my ear get matured in a lot, it dropped to the side. Uh, in a lot. In the locks, yeah. Oh, of course if you see the locks, it's gonna fall to the side. Because you are you 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 manipulate your hair. But if it's broken in the natural space, that's what I'm talking about. Yo, yo, yo. If you don't know where you are to stop talking, man, let me manipulate me. <laughs> You don't know nothing about locks. Let me tell you about locks. I'm me a locks man, you know. Me a locks man, you're balling. You know locks. So me, me I tell you how locks grow. Me, me no money to yeah, okay. my ear. Me no twist up my ear and turn up my ear and twist, twist and curl up my ear. Me, me, my, from me a raster fat yard is my ear a grow. I mean, I tell you, say, after it reach a certain maturity, it fall to the, the side. Me never twist okay, up my ear. So, so when you was a kid, Mute, your hair was growing, um, you didn't have locks at the time, right? Your hair was growing, right? Listen to a man with locks for 40 years. I mean, no, you're not 40 years old. I mean, I mean, I locked before you, <laughs> before you, man. Anyway, we have to move. We have to move. Why, my brains. <laughs> Why, Rebel Salute, thank you. I cool out a Rebel Salute this weekend, yeah. Mm -mm. All right, where were they? I locked down with a play the music, you know. But that no music me not play, that like this me not play. You can't believe something never don't play this thing, yeah? Uh, I see. We cannot even fathom the evil deeds of the corrupt popes. Among them, Pope Leo X enjoyed works of art and collected masterpieces. He invited artists like Michelangelo, Leonardo da Vinci, and Raphael to the Vatican and richly ornamented the church. Being driven by his vanity, he constructed St. Peter's Basilica. However, as he ran out of money by collecting costly works of art, he started to print a greater amount of indulgences. An indulgence is a certificate giving the forgiveness of sins. The Catholic priest propagated that people were guaranteed to enter the kingdom of heaven safer when they gave more money. I tell you, them, them talk like, yes, yeah, 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 bless you. Yeah, Mota. Yes, sir. How you doing, man? Yeah, Mota, well, man, I tell you, over one or five minutes, me a whole, the yeah, amount man. of confusion and nonsense, they are here coming, yeah, they, they are here. Me I tell you, I may have to take it in, I may have to take it in and make it bounce off. Me I tell you, I got to take it on the chin. <laughs> I tell you. I mean, when you really listen, you know, you can see why our African race in the situation that it is, you know. Mm. A lot of the people confused and spouting a lot of nonsense and going on strong with the nonsense, too. You hear this, bridge, you know, tell me, say, I listen to the name, Emmanuel. Yes, nonsense. And, and, and Emmanuel, no, we know we and which Emmanuel means God is with us. No, no. Eilis Selassie is, 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 is Tafari McConnell and then with the coronation is Eilis Selassie. Yeah, yeah. Madness. And, and then the next one about um, Eilis Selassie made Ethiopia into a mighty military right. power. So, That's a me, total lie. But I not me a try find a way my Absolute and total lie. Because if Eilis Selassie had made Ethiopia 
into a mighty military power. Mm. Then the Mussolini Italian army couldn't yeah. defeat, the British, and, the and that was why he had to come into exile, brought in Britain, and then was and brought in back by the British the, troops. The, the this British. is all on record. Yeah, but I don't know what, you see, it's, it's a, it's a, you can't tell you, I can't tell you something, Bridget. May I rest this is Christian know, Bible we're there, we're there, foolishness we're there, we're there, we're there. and about Jesus Christ is the salvation. Jesus Christ is not the salvation for African people. The yeah, salvation yeah. for African people is our African selves, Mandy guided God. by the philosophy and opinions of Marcus Garvey. Well, yeah, you never tell him so must go read the philosophy. Yes. What be the man thing? I'm going to tell you something. May I rest yes. you know, but you want know. You have some rasta illusion and rasta delusion delusion where they delude themselves in this rasta thinking where me say what we you mean say that catch them too i mean really you come out of christianity and say christianity are illusion are you coming out rasta now and i carry the same illusion in a rasta too what you got to show you that them carry the baggage of Christianity with the whole European thing because all the one who was talking about um, them get a different name. Uh, 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 yes, exactly. Because all right, the first disciples and followers with Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, who spoke Ar- Aramaic, that Aramaic. was the lingua franca yeah. at, at, at the time, were like Jews like himself and thing. But the point that you were making, which which, which is the key point is that until Constantine, the Roman emperor, mm. made um, Christianity, yeah. the state religion, yeah. it never had the impact and so that it had and is that Romanized control with Constantine yeah, of, in, of Christianity. In, <clears throat> that right. is responsible for the mental enslavement and the physical enslavement of African people up until this day. Right in Turkey. That happened right in a Turkey. Yes, it, yes, by Nisia. Nisia. Yes. And yes, yes, in yes, Asia Minor. Man, you know, before man. the Turks were there, because as we know, yes. Const- what them call Istanbul now is, 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 is what's called Constantinople after um, yes, yes. The, 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 the Roman Emperor Constantine, yes, who yes. used Christianity as a state religion, use it, and it was to counteract the African religion mm. from Kemet, Egypt, which was the dominant religion at the time. Yeah. They, they, they don't even know that because they don't study mm. and they do not want to study. My man tell me, say, me must go do my study. He said, I must go do my study, Rasta. Me me go do you tell them to read the, philosoph- the, the, the destruction of black civilization by Chancellor Williams. Mm. We give a history of the African race. You tell them to read the books of Sheik Anta Diab from Senegal, mm. the African origin of civilization. You tell them to read the philosophy and opinions of Marcus Garvey, edited by his second wife, Amy G. X. Garvey, they know who you and I knew personally. They know, they, they know you're the man, say, they know you're the man just say, him up. Him up, but him, him don't read it. He never read it. I'll tell me about no Zodiac, this and Zodiac, that and that. This is Zodiac thing. Yeah. But I don't know Zodiac thing. How Zodiac thing help us? Zodiac don't help us is we have to help ourselves as Africans. Mm. It, 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 it's madness and what it shows the amount of time that it takes. And, and the danger in this is that these people go around and miseducate people who don't know better and, and, and spread the infection of yeah, ignorance yeah, 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 amongst yeah. our people and make it hard. I tell you, man. It's not our people to be mentally um, liberated. You know what yeah, I mean? And, me too, you know, man. we just remember it's just Tuesday, God was the first wife, my mother, mother, cousin, 120th birthday anniversary. But you can imagine the same kind of problems Marcus Giave, Malcolm X, and other Africans mm-hmm. had in their time. It's the same problems that we have in today where we have to be fighting against the ignorance uh, tell you, tell you of so many of our people. Them call and make the, uh, the, the, the man will tell me about me against Jesus. I mean, I say, you hear me attack anything against Jesus Christ. Are the people them? What at no them? time? What you talk about is people who use this Jesus Christ business yes, to, 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 business. to dominate and control people. You have never ever attacked yeah, but, Jesus Christ but, but in but any shape Jesus or Christ. form. But when me attack Jesus Christ, we don't know nothing about Jesus Christ. Pre- pre- precisely. 
me attack people. What, what, you, what, what, you know, what you know about what the Romans, with yeah. Constantine, the Roman Emperor, yeah. the Roman Catholic Church, and the Protestants, ah. too, who come out of that thing. You know what them do to our people and all of slave ship name, yeah. Jesus yeah. of yeah. Lubeck and them yeah. thing there. Jonathan. So we deal, we dealing with reality, with facts. Yeah. Yeah. Me know We're dealing with facts, but a lot of these people, they caught up into total ignorance and you, you know me have to big up Bridge, you know, always I listen to the program from Central Kingston, Wildman Street, my Bridge in Evan, Cool Walks and people them from St. John's Road, Spanish Town and all over who listen to the program, Twin in Birmingham and thing. But Muta, this this is why this work that we do in of educating our people is non stop. Is a day and night work, you know, because of the propaganda of the racist Europeans are so enslaved the minds of our people. Because to this day, and you're hearing it on your program since night again, this Jesus Christ diversion, not dealing with African liberation, you know. Madness. Total, total madness. And then we, we, we see all... Issues like um, like Obama giving him so-called farewell speech yeah, in Chicago. Yeah, yeah. What was he doing for the eight years when Chicago is like the number one city where Chirac. African youths are kill African youths? Eh? Chirac, them call it now, Chirac. Yes, eh? I'm about him crying and thing. He did things to homosexuals and lesbians, do things to the Hispanics who racist against African people. Do things for the Israelis, them, and nothing for African people. But was telling African people to vote for Hillary Clinton, and he maintained the racist sanctions on Zimbabwe in following George Walker Bush in the attempt to overthrow President Mugabe of Zimbabwe. But President Mugabe is still here, and he's on his way out. Yeah. On his way out. Barack Obama, who was used, as you and I know, to, to, to make our people passive and to cool them off from them revolutionary fight. And it succeeded to a large extent with a lot of our people, not all of our people, because you and I were not fooled, you know? Yeah. But yes, we can and we did. What did he do? African people in the States worse off with Obama. Guantanamo Bay is still open. You know, yeah, I know I we are our only salvation as African people, and our people need to put into practice Marcus Garvey's Black Prince solution mm -hmm. as outlined plainly and clearly, as he has said, in his philosophy and opinions, yeah, no which is a collection no of his speeches and writings edited by his second wife, Amy no J. Garvey. No, go around the no, corner yes. book there. No corona corner, plain no, and direct. No parable, no Nothing parable. abstract. Yeah, no parable. <laughs> no parable. You know? Anyway, we have to move, though. We have to move. Yeah, blessed love. Just keep on the good work. And yeah. I know sometimes when these, these um, uneducated and uninformed people, some of them in them is Rastas, some like the Zodiac one and them people, when, when they come with the thing, you, you really have to deal with them, but... You have to go minimize the, 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 them time, man, because the, the amount of nonsense and yeah, drivel yeah, that yeah, them yeah. come with and yeah. accusing you of but, saying things that you don't say. But here, what Telling you, lies. You, you see, sometimes when them say something, you know, you can't make them just get away with it, you know. No, you can't make them get away with yeah, it. You have no, to deal why, with them and bring yeah, them to account, you know what I mean? Come back and say, and you know, I'm going to know other reason why you tell me about this reason, yeah. Because man. what them do, you know, like them playing hopscotch, you know. Yeah, when you catch uh, them on one thing, them jump them to jump something to else, next, you know. Them jump to the next thing. Every one of them. Every one it, of them. Every one yes, of them. every one of them, man. Yeah. The hopscotchers, you know. Idiot them, you know what I mean? Uh, For real. I'm big up my brethren, Raymond and Dunkirk, yeah, Wild yeah. Street. You give thanks, brethren. And thing. Yeah. All right. Blessed Lord. Yeah, that was the cutting edge. Stay tuned. Today, Thursday. From 2 to 5.45 for the stepping razor. The art of war. Trust me. A big thing I go up for the stepping razor tomorrow. Like a war. We are tricks. We are tomorrow. I will leave things for the continent tomorrow. Stepping razor. You know, yeah, yeah. Unbelievable. I will leave things for the continent tomorrow. 
Oh gosh, man, may I tell you, say, there's no water can out this fire. Make it burn, man. May I tell you. So you want know. We give thanks to the moment, give thanks to the time. I gone, we gone, you know. Hey. Oh, eh? Mind when you step outside, uh, my freezer. Why? It's cold out there. Rain a fall. No rain a fall. my yard, rain a fall and breeze a blow. Rain a fall, me not no chicken. True. True it cold? Oh gosh, man. I don't mean when I go in the hotel room. Right now. <laughs> I tell you. <laughs> you see, yes? That means it better done before Friday and Saturday. We are going to... We are going to rebel salute, yeah. Still, I bet I call that it rain, still, you know. I bet I call that it rain, trust me. But we are going to long a treasure, we are going to, you know, we are going to beach to where I did. We are going to long a rebel salute Friday and Saturday. I do some hosting work, MC work, you know what I mean, really? So, you want to know, I got regard, you know, the man named Matrix in the house. We are going with this junior named Mesopotamia. Even in the instrumental music in Jamaica, the man them the conscious of Africa to the point where they, even though they're instrumental, them call the tune them half as something about Africa. And even though Mesopotamia is the old name for Iraq, it was very symbolic because a whole heap of the things them were usually hear about Iraq, like Babylon and them places there, is in a Mesopotamia. So, musical Mesopotamia, Dan Drummond, we're gone. <laughs>